officially way, properly. Who, who he doesn't oh. have a Kag actor? Many, many, many people. You and Kag, Wait. primarily. There have been changes, I see. Well, we're gonna go over these right. changes. Looks uh, exactly the same so... as last week. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Doubt. <laughs> Right, I need exactly to get the, the game up so people can see whether, for themselves, whether it's changed or not. So it is exactly the same. Oh my goodness. It's been improved. Kind of. <laughs> the materials are different in some The materials places. are different. Yeah, that's all that's changed. Just just some real changes. Kind of so, kind of expensive changes. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so yes, welcome to... Episode two, I guess, is technically what this would be. Yeah. So Hi, should we start by informing people of what we spoke about earlier and the fact that, like, well, should we do an in reintroduction? Considering a, we've got two new players, we might have new people. Yeah, I, I yeah, I was going to do and that, and then we'll move the on to intro, intro of. Oh, I was going to do them the other way around. Which oh, okay, Wait, you choose. You are the streamer. You choose. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to do the introduction to what we're doing first as okay, cool. a. <laughs> uh, as a scenario. So, good evening, everybody. Hi, hello. hello. I'm DJ, uh, and and I am acting as um, this little dude tormentor down here. in chief. This little for, dude. for this lot. Um, so, uh, basically, what is happening is this base has been set up by a group of uh, uh, rather powerful individuals known as the Archive. Um, at this point, this lot don't know anything about the archive. They haven't even been informed that they're part of the archive. Um, we don't know what are. an archive would be. We don't know how to write yet. Yeah, quite. Um, <laughs> so, essentially, what has happened is um, something has gone horribly, horribly wrong with this particular archive, um, and uh, the people that were supposed to turn up to live here didn't, which was a slight issue. Um, and that was many and so, years ago. This AI has been sitting here for like a thousand odd years, sitting and waiting for people to turn up, and they haven't. And eventually, it used the last of its power to draw some primitive tribals into its grasp. That's They us. were running away from their town <laughs> because their town had been munched by insects. We don't like them. Um, they, they came here, and they decided to live here, and, and all is good. Well, Except we were promised kingshipness, good. living like well, better than kings. That was what we well, promised. Well, yeah. And to be fair, I'm already delivering on that. <laughs> we, yes. We, we are supposed to live as mega chiefs. Mega, mega chiefs. Mega chiefs. Yes. That's that was yep, the yep, one. Yep, yep. Mega chiefs. Yep. So yep. basically, he's convinced this lot of tribals that they should hang around and help him out, um, and is now treating them as flesh robots to do his bidding. Yes. Uh, and we don't um, know quite how insane this AI is. As far as we're concerned, he's some kind of god being. Sally is the only one that has any knowledge of what technology is. Um, and conveniently isn't here today. And uh, <laughs> has also conveniently been lying through their teeth about things to them. Um, yes. And telling them that, that the batteries contain lightning spirits and things yes. like that. Yes, because um, it's the tag take simplest way. Yeah, it's the simplest <laughs> way to explain it. <laughs> So, uh, what hey, is... hey, I'm going to be too stupid to understand any of this, so it's fine. Uh, so, <laughs> uh, what is happening right now is, um, in, in terms of the story, uh, it is currently one o'clock in the morning, um, and our characters are generally sleeping at this point, uh, yep. whether that be in their beds or in the hospital. Um, and exactly. unbeknownst to them, some holes in the wall have opened up. And some robots have slipped out. And done some work, and then fucked off again. And by the time they wake up in the morning, all evidence of their uh, being there <laughs> is gone. But and it looks like things have changed. The fairies have put things together for us. Uh, the the two... gods have rewarded us with. with there, the, there are several. There are several key changes. Mm. Uh, first of all, the shitty dugout bedrooms have light <laughs> pipes and um floors and are made of plasteel now yeah uh, you'll also find that there's piping throughout most of the base um certainly enough for you guys to build off of beautiful 
uh, power <coughs> is also running through most of the base. The vanometric power cells down the bottom have been connected to the main network. Woo. So you don't lose as much power overnight, but you are now using a fuck ton more power. I do really, <laughs> really oh, want yeah. to stress that. Yeah. Um, That's 8,000. Because yep. if you look at your uh, kill box in particular... Yep. We have a f an upgrade. Uh, I got sick of the game beating you up last time. That was a bit unfair. So, um... There you go. <laughs> we did well, surprisingly. You know, considering... I, 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 was, in I was moderately impressed that you survived, but I, I don't think you would have for much longer. To yeah. be blunt. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like we should at least no, should. leave two on. Just in case we mess up. We should at least leave two. <clears throat> I would just turn them all off and just make sure you flick them all on when you get the chance. But that's up to you. I'm not going to tell you what to do. Manage your power. Um, Sounds like five minutes of Freddy's. To reiterate <laughs> to our new players, do not deconstruct anything. That all. Roger. I've do not want to become lightning mush. The moving shelves. <laughs> They can I, reasonably do that, you know, with their little arms. And even that I grumbled at. But I allowed them magnanimously to remove their shelves. That was nice of you, Mr. Yes. Lightning God. <laughs> Who still hasn't I, given us any way to call you other than... Thank you, our benevolent God. I am a gracious God, it's fine. <laughs> um, so, anyway, uh, that's everything. I think. Cool. Do you want to oh, go yeah, over the... Oh, yeah, and they're growing copious, copious amounts of drugs. That should also be pointed oh, yes. out. <laughs> so many. All of the drugs. drugs. These uh, is drugs, uh, these is drugs, these is drugs, these is drugs. <laughs> I will drugs. also point out that, that taking drugs is banned in this AI's colony, and if anyone is caught taking drugs, there will be consequences. But can we use them for training and earning cash? That's Breeding. the only That's reason the for their existence. Yeah. Perfect. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Drugs exist to trade, not to take. Have we got enough like drugs yet? Map, I don't know why. We haven't Have actually had a way. harvest yet. <clears throat> Have you right. got a drug production bench? No, no we haven't researched so... drugs yet. Yeah, we're making an area, an area for it now. Hang on, I need to... Un... No, no, uh, so I found out that uh, these two shooting targets should not go over here because they fire upon the wall. So we need more melee targets and we need a better place to put the shooting targets. None of the targets should be in the kill box. I yeah, they're moving. They're, they're moving, but okay. we just need not to make the shooting target ones. They're being uninstalled. The shooting target ones would be good to be in the fields, to be honest with you. Yes. Because then you can just put them in the middle of a field and it doesn't yeah. matter. Yeah, because where they were put... No, don't put them over there. You put it over there. That's outside. Yeah. Who's no. No. What are you putting things outside of the defensive perimeter? That's what Dan is doing. <laughs> yeah, no, that's that's a really bad idea. That just leads <laughs> you having to replace it after every fracking raid. Stop. Stop. Hammer time. Do do do. do, 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 do. Right. <laughs> Let's uninstall them and we'll figure out where to put them later. Anyway. <laughs> uh, so yes, do you want to go over part two? So, the other thing. Th this file will probably end before we finish the story. This is largely because Kagarus. Kag, it's all your fucking fault. Love you, Kag. Your idea. Correct. <laughs> what did Kag do? <laughs> We're just going to go over that in a second. Well, Kag, uh made the mistake of going, DJ, I need ideas for mods. <laughs> Which was foolish. Very, very um, foolish. Because I have ideas. I was going to say, anyone who's ever met DJ will know giving him any sort of like in like that is a bad idea. Unless... Kag has known me for long enough, <laughs> yeah. in my defence, that he yes. knows this shit. Yeah, yeah. Um, but for all the so people Kag... that don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so Kag has uh, started creating some mods, and so far we've we've done some fairly simple stuff. Um, we've got a shield belt that acts as armor, 
so that you don't have to have all your pawns wandering around in armor, which is nice. Uh, we have a, um, a plant that Cag's done called Steak Root, uh, which you can process into uh, fake meat, basically, so that you can actually <gasps> have vegan pawns. That's that cool. you don't have to, to do animals. Yeah, That's right. That's cool. Uh, he's also looking um, at doing a vegan, um, what's it called? Uh, trait, right. eventually. Yeah. Uh, cool. Minigun and double minigun turrets. Um, so that you can have turrets with more bang for your buck. Uh, they also the miss a lot. It's kind of hilarious. Can, can you make um, a, a game that gives more storage? Because I sometimes feel like the 75 is a little low. No. That's what. There's loads of other mods that do that. Yep. We've even got one. <laughs> In this game. Uh, yes. Uh, and um, the one that we're now starting to look at is uh, essentially a new faction called the Techno Tribals. Um, and, not influenced and... by this entire scenario whatsoever. No, not at all. <laughs> um... <laughs> but yeah, we, we kind of are developing this far better. Um, and will include ideas, uh, hopefully, that are going to be really neat. Um, <clears throat> things like, uh, like replacing research with prayer. Praying <laughs> to the AI god. I was also <laughs> contemplating it giving you, um, sci focus while you're doing it. Yeah. Wouldn't make sense. Yep. But it should give you less research if it also gives you psych focus, right? No, because it's for tribals only. I'm gonna lock it's it for, for tribals. I was only. about to say it's yeah. for tribals, which means that your research is stupid slow. Okay. Yep. Research takes five hundred percent as long as a tribal. I thought it was four hundred percent. Oh, is it four hundred percent? I apologize. I got the 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 the, <laughs> the number yeah. wrong. It's uh, something like that. Uh, it increases by one hundred percent for each uh, tech level you're below the tech you're researching. Yeah. So if you're Neolithic, like we are. All the Neolithic text are just hundred percent. All the medieval, I think, I think, are two hundred percent. All the modern yeah. are three hundred, and all the above are four hundred percent. Basically, it takes forever to research anything. Yep. A million um, zillion years. So that's all dealt with already. A um, uh, question: Is that actually uh, colony, uh, well, f faction based, or is that palm based? Which. The technology Research. level. I believe yeah. it's the trait that it. it uh, no, the tech level is based on your faction. Okay. It's not based on the colonist itself. So you could have a, a tribal with a spacer background. It wouldn't make any difference. <coughs> I was enough. thinking about the research bot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still same deal. Cool, cool. Right, I'm gonna at least start this yeah. moving because. But one we of the get things somewhere. that. One of the things we would like um, is if you have ideas for the techno tribals, we'd like to hear them um, because uh, I'm, I'm been, I've been brainstorming for you, Keg, and you're going to hate me and love me all at the same time, <laughs> just to warn you. That's already the case. Uh, why are we still losing power? Because uh, it's mm -hmm. the middle of the night yeah. and you rely mainly on solar fair. power. Yep. <laughs> Don't uh, forget, Graham... this is a solar colony. Yeah, and Graham, quickly. Uh, I kind of forgot that my pal is a night owl, or is it? Yeah, night owl. What's up, Keg? You know, being complaining of. Oh, I've got a different version to the belt. You do yeah. now. Stop. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. So there's now four different versions of the shield belt we've designed. Uh -huh. So there's quite a cheap one, which is the equivalent of wearing a set of flak armor. All the way through to a really expensive one that's the equivalent of a cataphract bomb. Right now, there is black, you have recon, you have power armor, which is also called marine armor for some reason in the code. Yeah. And you also have cataphract, which require each one requires you to have that tech researched. So, cataphract, you have to have cataphract armor. As well as the shield belt research yeah. and the nanotech belt research. Yeah, so now the nanotech. Uh, research does nothing on its own. Yeah. You have to then research something else. I like okay. that belt. a lot. DJ, yeah. question. Yes. Uh, the wall light above the comms console. Do I have uh, to yes. permission to move it one to the right? Do you have permission to move it one to the right? Yes. Yeah, so oh, uh, I would say 
I would say, do we have permission to move the comms console somewhere else? No. Okay. Why would you want to move the comms console somewhere else? It's in a perfect place. You say that. Do I have permission to move the wall right? Hello? Uh, no, I think he's you, thinking. Can't do, you can't rewire it or anything, so no. Okay. When you've learned how to do electrics, then you can maybe start fiddling around with things like that. <laughs> okay. Sounds fair. Also, reinforced walls. <clears throat> right. So we do want to get these two people on our side. Yeah. I presume at this point all of our colonists are waking up or have woken up now and are going, Oh my goodness, everything's changed, that's crazy, what? Well, and... uh, one of the things I forgot is one of them's a night owl, so I don't yeah, know what the night right. owl thought. Well, he was in, like, the kitchen literally just making food all evening. I'm pretty sure he went for a shit at some point and came out and was just like, What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Heard loads of weird noises but just ignored it. Hi, uh, you, you the night owl. Come on, what, what did you say? Yeah, I was just cooking dinner. <laughs> he was in his own world, cooking dinner. I like the quiet around me. Oh, by the way, Tiroi. Yeah? In our other file, just so that you know, Yeah. Uh, you and Ragoon got engaged last night. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I thought you should know. In, a, in our other file, Tiroi is a 17-year-old girl who's just agreed to get married to a 27-year-old man. In a colony of how many men? Here we there's go! Five there's five dudes in Tiroi. Um, <laughs> Kag! Yes? Kag, you have a pawn now. Oh, fabulous. Let's see how terrible he is. <laughs> Not. That's why we're recruiting him. Oh, cool. Can you I are a slowpoke. Yep, yeah, you can, can rename, rename him. You are a slowpoke, but you're also a fast learner. Also a human computer. And oh, the yes. only uh, uh, applies to movement speed. Yeah. So I'll yeah. basically put him behind that research bench and it's fine. Yeah. You uh, also yeah, have yeah, a flame in shooting. You are a wonk. Um, oh, okay. oh, yeah, that, that's that's also um, something. Um, CAG. Oh, crap, I am a wonk. I, yeah. I think <laughs> that the... Yeah, you are a wonk. I think that that should actually be taken into the mod. Like, What's they're that? not doing science, they're not doing research, they're not doing prayer, they're wonker- they're wonking. Oh, so instead of it saying researching, wonking. Yes. Yes. Can you explain to me wonk? Yes. Uh, so, this is a term I picked up from a um, uh, run-through uh, that someone's doing on YouTube. You have a mad rap, by the way, you might want to deal with. Uh, I um, just told everyone to go inside. Uh, I recall so... the boss. Here he comes. Dan hasn't gone inside. Has he not? Where is he? Dan is, that oh. is in the field. Oh, He'll right. probably no, be no, fine. Okay. He'll Have probably be fine. Have you turned on fine. any of the turrets? Yeah, Have all you... of them. Then they're all turned off. They're off. Don't worry, no, it's, it's, it's toggle power, so they'll yeah. be on soon. Yeah, yeah it, 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 because... Uh, uh, Where are you going? My bomb's no. going to do it. I was about to say, I'm trying what? to get Izzy to fucking turn the switches on the guns My on. My doing it, relax. Okay, cool. It's fine, they, we didn't need them anyway. Yeah, yeah, Izzy just murdered it. Right. Need to get better at that, though. <laughs> um, Definitely. So, yeah, there's, there's a series that I'm watching on YouTube at the moment, um, which I would heartily recommend to anyone. Uh, um, uh, by a chap, um, the, the channel it's on is called Game World Narratives. Um, but it's uh, a YouTuber called Officially Devin, and okay. what he's doing is he takes he's taken a, a RimWorld run um, and then turned it into an audio book, right. like a full-on audio book where all of the characters have conversations, etc. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, and the story in his one is that um, essentially the the people who formed the colony are from a medieval planet. <laughs> and they're on what they think is a holy crusade. Uh -huh. um, and they refer to scientists as wonks. Right. And it's just been picked up from that. 
um, my character started using it in the game we're playing on the, the football server but at the why? minute. why? Where does it come from? I have no idea. It's just a okay. made-up word. It's a bit like um, one of his factions in it sound vaguely South African and use the term butter as a kind of swear word also term for a friend. Okay. Like literally butter, like you'd spread yeah. on something. Yeah. Yeah. And it's amazing how quickly butter sounds like a, a, a naughty word. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, so, but, so he's, using he's saying own... butter. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, wonk, wonk I... is his term for a scientist. And I've just, I, I adore it. I love it. It's like when uh, frack, frack like became a swear word. The wonk word. I, it's, I... Li it's literally just monk. Oh yeah, that's a good point. I hadn't considered that. You may because well be correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. You, you, you may well be entirely right there, dude. If they think they're on a holy crusade and scientists are doing yeah, something yeah, that yeah, yeah, is yeah. the work of God, they are yes, monks. I, yeah, they're, they're a wonk monk. Yep, that is almost certainly correct. Okay. Uh, DJ I still things. haven't heard the phrase wonk, but okay. Uh, DJ, yeah. two things. Uh, firstly, yeah. I built a, I planned a new growing pet outside the base because otherwise we're burning us to the fields. Can't yeah. be healthy. Yep. Secondly, the old burning pit is bugged out. Uh, yeah. In what way? I cannot de uh, order the deconstruction or delete the build. Ah, uh, okay. Remind, I will get rid of it next time. <laughs> Next time he does things that definitely don't well, involve Well, to be honest, Izzy, things. if at any point you have to re-host, mm -hmm. uh, quickly go into dev mode and delete it. You say that like I know how to go into dev mode. You go into options and click the little button that says dev mode. That's far too difficult. Then assuming you know <laughs> what to do in dev mode. You I'll figure it out. You click the little alien head at the top, which turns on god mode, and then you click on the item in question and press delete. Do you know, the entire Thanks. time I've used dev mode, I've not pressed that button ever. <laughs> what, the god oh. mode button? Yeah. That's how this entire base has been built. Like, with the, you know, all the alterations that I did between last week and this week. That's how oh. they were done. I just did it in god mode. Makes always sense. So it's because you're a is... god, obviously. Exactly. Also, you do have permission to, like, move the beds. Yeah? You okay, have cool. bedrooms now. You can, like... And you can move the, those two rooms that are currently the, the double bedrooms if you want to com convert them into, like, a wonkery or a production room or something like that, then feel free. Mm -hmm. uh, don't think I have a bed anywhere. No. No. You might we need, need to, to get you, you ones. Can, well, no, you could just move one of the prisoner beds for the time being and convert it. I, I am cool. okay with that as long as a prisoner bed is put back in there at the first available opportunity. Like, you know, give you people beds and shit. Well, we could make a cloth bed. Well, yeah, but surely that's for your prisoners, not for your people. I know, it's like the best like, bed we got right don't now. Make, don't make poor Cag's character lie on the floor on a, in a fucking bundle of cloth on a no, it's sterile a bed. floor. It's a bed! It's a bed, yeah, it's a bed. It's a oh, okay. bed. Oh, it's yeah. It's a fur bed. They're actually you... really good. You can't get hypothermia in those, no matter how yeah. cold it gets. It's yeah. Mm. Which ones? Uh, they're under uh, f just furniture, I think. The yeah, just furniture. I'm 2,000 ticks behind. Uh, I it's believe we're it will saving. be in extended furniture. Someone pause it. It's it furniture. No, it's furniture. Oh, no, what, I don't... The cloth bed. Yeah. Yeah, it's under the furniture. The fur bed. It's oh, under furniture. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, bed roll. Yeah. It, no, oh no, 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 no. Cloth no, fur no, double bed. bed roll. Yeah. So, uh, it's in the same one. Uh, it's okay, called uh, fur I'm bed, back. but it requires mm. cloth. It or requires cloth it or fur. Cloth, plain leather, <clears throat> camel hide, mm -hmm. bear skin, uh, light leather, chinchilla fur. Can, can't we use some of the drag space to make cloth? No. Trust me, we've but tried. I was, I was thinking you were going to say no. <laughs> uh, I mean... We've got, got some, some cotton. Cloth, I don't yeah. usually use drugs in real mode. The amount of money you make is insane. I know, what? but I usually make on a sort of an organ farm. 
Not inefficient. Fine. Yes, I know it's inefficient. Him. It, I, it just seems easier than making drugs. I don't know why. Can't be asked to do it, I don't know. You also don't have this mod pack. Like, trust me, in this mod pack, you want to be producing a lot of drugs. Many. Yep. Because, uh, you see, if you go into the research tab, Romanian, uh, okay. And, uh, if you press shift, you can zoom it out. Fucking finally, for me, it's just, I don't have to press shift in my games. I don't know why. It's so strange. But, anyway, um, if you go to the furthest right-hand research, like, all the way on the right. The Genesis, yes. Yeah, that is a spaceship. I know. There are several spaceships before that that we can research. The moment have... we get our hands on one of them, you are going to want a lot of drugs. I have I have played with the mother that's the Genesis before. Yeah. Combine that with a crafting bot and hey presto. And the growing bot. Yep. I should probably use the As I said, I basically don't need you lot at this point. <laughs> You just needed someone to come in and turn them all on. Oh, they're saying that we bought the garden bot. You didn't yeah, have no, you him. bought the garden bot and the crafting bot. To be fair, like, yeah. and you still it... need us to go and take stuff around to actually deliver stuff to places. Yeah, exactly. I need one human to trade for me, basically. The rest no trading bot. <laughs> or someone to get analysis bot for you. Well, to be honest, I'm assuming I know how to do all that shit. It's just that, like, I'm slowly doling the information out to you so that I don't give you mm. culture shock. And, like, That's your researchers sensible. aren't researching. Mm. They're being taught shit. The deserter? You don't do that quest. Shall I delete it? Anyway. Nope. Do not do it. We will Shall be I delete working it? Yep. We will be working with this empire a lot. They seem actually vaguely civilized. Vaguely civilized. Yeah. Seem to understand the importance of, you know, finery and things like that. Of slave labor? Well, we don't agree with that. Oh, we don't? No. Nope. Oh. <coughs> Every human should be free to serve me. <laughs> he convinces them. He doesn't enslave them oh exactly so it's, more, it's more akin to brainwashing than uh, outright slavery oh absolutely the archive is a full-on cult <laughs> i didn't realize it for i didn't realize it for quite a while while i was playing as them and then at one really? point i was just like it just oh fuck this is completely a cult <laughs> um, yeah they, they are completely and totally a cult it's kind of funny So what's it like playing as a cult? Well, to be fair, they're like, it's a weird kind of cult with really noble intentions. So, like, it's weird because they, they are genuinely attempting to, like, Make save good. hum- Well, they're, they're trying to save humanity. From? I itself. I, so the, the backstory of the archives uh, to explain is that um, they are they were set up the, the first archive was set up by a couple um, a gentleman called Butler and a lady called Lover and um, Lover had been to two separate planets that she had watched then nuke themselves into oblivion and Butler's home planet was also nuked into oblivion um, <laughs> And that was where they met when his planet was in the process of being nuked. Um, and basically, they're fairly convinced that essentially, no matter what, humanity will end up destroying itself. It's on doomed every to destroy itself. It yeah. On. Yep. Yeah. Um, and uh, like most people in such a situation, they think they know better. Um, make sure the doors at the top are held open. I've I've done the well. Yeah, I've done the middle one. I've done the outside ones. Oh, we were replacing the outside ones, weren't we? That was it. it. If ones do get personal rooms, can we move around the furniture? 
inside your room. Yeah, you yeah. can do what the fuck you want inside your room as long as like it looks pretty. He's very, oh. very specific with that aspect. Britia is in the beauty stat or? No, he needs to think actually that it's pretty. Yep, you have to meet my aesthetic standards. Which are very, very, very high. <laughs> and s often stupid. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm, I, I mean, like, it's not like in my current run through, I'm literally saving up 200,000 gold just so that I can pave my pathways in gold. That is exactly what you're doing. It is. <laughs> Exactly. Probably fine? Question mark? Probably. Wait, why? Who's roofing the uh, kill box? Oh no, it's automatically because of the, um, oh, the doors. Yeah. You yes. just need to tell it to unroof. Do people are roofing it? Yep. She's doing it, fortunately. All that growing space going to waste why? otherwise. Oh, I was about to say, why would roofing a kill box be bad, but then I just realized, wait, we're making drugs in there. Yep. Also, this is a special type of land that has like a 70% move speed, so it's very good for it. I was about mm. to say, top tip. <laughs> you can plant long grass if you've got um, uh, vanilla plants expanded. We that's have. We can plant that. Is it, that's just an option, it, but it do. doesn't give profit. Yeah, we, we do have that option, um, Romania. It's in one of the mods we have. It just no, doesn't he's not generate profits. In the base game, you can't do that, but in this, we can. No, I know that we can in the base game. He yeah. doesn't want to lose profit. <laughs> oh, god, yeah, no, no. We aren't losing any. Like, the AI has told them, like, make saleable goods. That's that's their, That was their first fucking job. Get themselves at home, start learning shit that I'm going to teach you, and start making shit we can sell. Mm. Electricity. Electricity. He seems more like a prophet rather than a god. Electricity. Listen, to us, he's a god. Oh, by the way, Tiroi, I forgot. You also need to be able to make sterile floors before you can move that wall. Okay. So, electricity, uh, the reinforced wall of the Sterile, sterile walls. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Essentially, if you move anything, it better damn well look the same afterwards. Is is the rule? Yeah. Oh, I just wanted to move the wall like that. Okay. I know. Yeah, I know. You know, I I see like we are uh, trying to dig something. Uh, can I deconstruct one wall? No. No. This one. No. No, because I need destroying something the AI built, and I get very unhappy with you. They get very Which unhappy. Which wall are you trying hey, to de Akinobi. destroy? Uh, this one. Uh, the area we're trying to build inside the base. Next to the AI cog itself. Right next Wait, to where did you move him back? Where did... No, because Milkshake's got a better weapon for it. Yes, he might kill him with it! No, Milkshake won't. Almost certainly. Like, that weapon's good at knocking it's people. A loose, it's a hammer, not a monosword. Yes, I know, so. but I've had them have themselves crushed oh, to death, trust me. Move him in before he kills the door. Yeah, yeah. Don't let that door get destroyed. I've never even come close to having a Rimworld colony. This <laughs> nice <laughs> well. <laughs> well <you're not> <laughs> funny story. <laughs> we started with it because it's a this situation. Isn't... There you go. Right hand destroyed. Right Love. leg destroyed. Left arm destroyed. See? Really? They're destroying him, Still yes. Alive. That's the important part. Yep. Only it's just what... It's all right. I'm sure a certain god can organize certain replacements. Quickly tend to him because he's going. Oh, he's going. He's going. Away. I'm going. Chill, chill, chill. There's an interesting trait on that that uh, Zeus hammer. Is there? Yeah. Hmm. I wonder Mark what wailing. it is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's my friend. Okay. Like, like seriously, the AI was like, "Yeah, my mate's here. He's a bit weird." <laughs> I actually got um. It was a Persona Monosword that um, reduces the heat you get from using powers. It, DJ, can you see what I'm selecting? Uh, where are you? Um, yeah. Also, I wonder what you might have to say about this quest that came in, Mr. AI. 
Oh, Post no, you can't deconstruct that wall. That wall's there because a bit got mined out that shouldn't have been. Just ignore it. When you get to it, when you mine to it, then yes, it can be deconstructed. It's a bit of mountain, that wall, yeah? That bit of marble wall is a piece of mountain. Ignore that it's a wall. I just accidentally made a wall there. Yeah, like, that, I made that's a hole. Yeah, 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 yeah. Have you seen and, the quest? Yeah, was somebody saying about how nice this base is? Yes, at Kenobi in the chat. <laughs> Hi. Um. It was kind Ooh. of started as because it's a custom scenario that we've uh, generated. Uh, you, thanks you're, to you're doing DJ. quite well stalking uh, DJ Zigo. Um, no, because. <laughs> DJ is joking, it's a no. really nice base. Good job. No, it's not. <laughs> it's ugly Wait. as sin, and it's really boring. Yeah. <laughs> but it's nice. It's pretty. Give DJ back. No, he's mine. For at least three hours. This, this quest looks very good, though. Yeah, yeah that's what I was, I was asking DJ about, but he keeps getting distracted. Oh, sorry. Yeah, you should do that, probably. Yeah. <laughs> and except what? Also, hey, Uma. I'd say um, the amount component in the claw... Personally. Yeah. We need the nag. Not really, it's more the advanced component we can sell the claw for a decent amount. Yeah. Exactly. So the middle one. Oh, okay, someone else ah, has done it. That's fine. Yeah. I just prefer to double check before. At the moment doing can it. I put peg legs on here? No. Oh. We will not accept a peg leg. I about to say, we've not what? been instructed to put a peg leg on him. I mean, I would Pots? suggest giving him a fucking peg leg at some point. Yeah, you just completed that quest. Oh yeah, it just hasn't been completed, completed. Well, no, it has, because it's forced weather for 18 I, days. it relays his destroyed limbs with wooden ones? <sighs> for the moment. Left arm, right arm, left arm, right leg, right hand. I mean, he is, like, completely fucking yeah, useless. We, yes, we... He had 0% manipulation. <laughs> Can I? Yes. Yes, you may. Of course, because he's got no left arm. He's got no, no he left arm gone. and no right hand. Uh, if you want to kill him, you have to do it within 16 hours. Uh, we're not killing him. No, we're not okay. killing him. We're giving him arms. I like the fact that the bruise in the right arm is what, cr is what knocked him down. I, I can't I can't uh, replace his arm. <laughs> Just his hand. Because ah, yeah. you can't do it at our the level. The power claw isn't hand either. Not it's the arm. It's uh, the hand, not just the whole arm, the pneumatic claw. I say, you can, you can replace his missing hand. Yeah, that's what they're doing. I'm giving him a lovely wooden one. Yeah, Good. you can you can always install the pneumatic claw. No. That hurts. Reduce it. Yeah, it also reduces work speed as well, which is also a pain. I don't yeah, think he that's knows. a problem when he can't use his hands. <laughs> he has no hands. Yeah, but it's doubly painful. What's he good at? Does he need his hands? Yeah. He's a brawler, he has melee. He's a medic, yeah. yeah. He's also a, go a, a gormand. Oh, right, yeah, he really needs his hands. <laughs> <laughs> and he's actually industrious. Which yes, is he's nice. about to say he's industrious as well. He's actually got some really good stats. Yeah. If you grind him up a bit, yes. I do think the... What's the highest medical apart? What's the highest medical we have? Why uh, is my door disallowed, by the way? What door? In the medic room. Oh, because they kept going through it and it kept making the freezer really, really warm. Oh, okay. You Shall really we... need to get on with drug production at this point, gang. It already has started. Where I'm is... one king. Shut up. <laughs> Where's... Where's drug production's your... going in research? We DJ? got we got oh, psychoid tea. Right, you, you you haven't started. You can't make psychoid yet. No, yeah, we're doing drug production right now. The only thing now. that's happening is in is psychoid tea. Yeah, fair, fair, yeah. fair. Um, what I'd recommend then is that um basket by the uh, kitchen. Put psychoid really in, for psychoid, yeah. Wicked. Is, cool. yeah. Yeah, wicked. Cool beans. I also uh, killed a wooden table shelf there, so 
because it is supposed to increase the cooking speed. Nice, nice. So, um, obviously part of what I'm trying to do here, with those of you that haven't played RimWorld as much, <coughs> is eat, um, <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, excuse me, I'm on 288 hours of this game. Yeah, like I said, <laughs> for those of you that are abject amateurs... <laughs> um... so, do you consider me an amateur? What, 280 odd hours? Fuck yeah. yeah do you consider me an uh, amateur? I also feel like the, uh, I've no, seen you... Okay, okay it's all right. in all honesty, I've seen you make some pretty simple mistakes. But I make silly, simple mistakes in this game all the fucking time, so I'm not actually certain. You're fairly competent, though, I would argue. But I actually have less hours in this game than Izzy. Interesting. I'm well, just you're that a shit. You're amateur as well. I, I have me. more hours in this game than Izzy. I'm sure of that fact. That's fine. It's not... Listen, I am the abject worse at this game. I will always be worse at whatever game I play. It's fine. <laughs> no, no, because in all honesty, Izzy, that's part of the point of this file, that we, we teach yeah. you some of the tricks, yeah? Like, I, re I really well, can't wait. Half of it is point. whether I want to actually use them or not. Uh, well, <laughs> no, no, because some of the tricks, right, like, you might be like, I don't want to be a psychoid dealer. Cool, yeah. but the lessons you'll learn dealing psychoid are applicable to lots of other trade goods. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, so yeah. the point. No, trading is definitely something like going out on trade missions isn't something I ever really did because a lot of my hours yeah. were actually before the world existed like that. Yeah, 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 exactly. Um, so, so yeah, there is a lot to be things, said for that. Yeah, that's one of the things I really want to hammer into you. Yeah, um, like the power uh, that you can gain by fucking off out and trading. I don't want to. It's it, Also, um. Because this is your first real modded run through, really looking forward to you realizing how awesome it is to have your own little spaceship. <laughs> That's the first time I've used really that mod. I have it. modded it myself before, but again, yeah, but, it was yeah, the, the, way back you, when. Uh, yeah, again, I'm talking about with this mod pack. Yeah. Yes. Because this mod pack is now like slowly but surely almost becoming the normal pack people are playing with. Like, there's a lot of us that are just using this pack because it's quite nicely balanced. Yeah. Um, balanced. <laughs> it, no, no. It is balanced. There are things in it that are completely unbalanced. I will entirely <laughs> agree. Yes. Yeah? But it is your choice to use them or not. There is nothing that you're forced to use. Yeah? It, then, it's oh, basically our previous uh, uh, Stellaris mod pack. Uh, what was that, yeah. sorry? It, this mod pack is, is comparable to our previous uh, Stellaris, Stellaris mod pack. one. Yeah, yeah. And Dan, the only thing I think that is grossly unbalanced, there is only one thing that I think is grossly, grossly unbalanced in this entire pack, and that's the analysis bot. I was yep. thinking more embrasures, robots, and STRS, but okay. you hate embrasures. I hate them. Yes. Yes, I get <laughs> that. And you are kind of right that they are unbalanced. You also missed the point in them entirely, in that they're also very, very realistic. Embrasures in real life aren't balanced. That's kind of the point. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's a defensive edge instead of just stand there and going, oh, I hope an enemy doesn't run around the corner. And to be honest with you, I would argue the same is true of just, like, do you build kill boxes? Or are you one of these people who's like, no, you shouldn't build kill boxes? <laughs> I like a basic kill box, yeah. Because, yeah, no, it's the same deal. It, it, the kill boxes aren't balanced. Like, the moment you build a kill box, you're abusing the game mechanic. Because it wouldn't happen like that. And I would argue embrasures are more realistic than a kill box. Combining the two is completely disgusting, and that's well, what I do. DJ... <laughs> DJ. Uh, kill boxes have been used sort of in history before. Not yeah, but, for this but, expand that is in remote, but yeah, no, and the you concept wouldn't... was still the same. The, in, in reality, if a bunch of people came to attack a town and there was a dark tunnel with alternating sandbags and then not, which just seemed to wind into the distance, no one's going in that fucking tunnel. <laughs> I'm, I'm talking more about the castles of the medieval times. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, I know, but... Uh, my, my point is that, like... Your point is, yes, I understand your point. You're saying that these skill boxes... Yeah, yeah they're, they're not balanced. Yeah. Um, 
I I actually disagree with you about uh, the shuttles. I think the shuttles are one of the best balanced things I've played in this, purely because of their fucking cost. Yeah, but the, uh, amount, the amount of money you can make with them completely rips that cost up. Change, no, it changes the, the balance of the game, doesn't ruin the balance. Because the game generally plays off of your wealth, actually what the shuttles do is make the game far harder. Like the Genesis ship. Oh, well, no, it's, it, it's once you get those ships, you start earning wealth really quickly. Which means that every raid is more and more and more powerful. Yeah, but you can meet some people who can buy the, all the weapons you need to defend it, so it makes yeah, it yeah, easy yeah, yeah. anyway. Um, but again, my problem with that is actually that we haven't got anything yet in between the two. That's what I want. Yeah? I Fair want... Enough, yeah. um, well, like, littler ships. Well, no. Uh, like... To start with, why aren't we upgrading from fucking uh, caravan animals to cars and trucks? True, there is a little bit of a skip. Yep. Right, we go from caravan animals to fucking spaceships. This, I, I'm not comfortable with. I would like there to be several stages between there, please. I also hate the fact that, you know, in game mode... Uh, the base game, you literally have all the caravans or the pods. What the fuck? There should be something in between. You can make cam fuel, you can, you know. Yeah, again, there should be cars. Not maybe used for the map, just, you know, for travel. Just it. That's it. Um. But I do really like the shuttles. I think they're nicely balanced. I think they play really well. I also think they make the game a lot more interesting because, to be honest with you, having built colonies at the scale that I build them at, in just base game, um, first of all, I will never miss the amount of animals that are necessary to run a large colony in base game. Pardon? No, no, nothing to do with that. Not for no, their no, meat. I was point out the state group. Oh no, 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 yeah, no, no, not not for their meat though, but not for their meat. You need shit tons of animals for a big base in base game, because that's the only way to get your hauling done. Oh, that's true, yeah. Um, and that bugs the shit out of me. The fact that I can't build a simple hauling robot in the base game really bugs me. Um, the other robots are a nice to have rather than, although no, the cleaning bot. It's a fucking what's it called? A, a, a Roomba. We yeah, literally Roomba. have them now. Why can't we build them in RimWorld? And that is one of the things that repeatedly bugs me with RimWorld. We're building technologies in it quite often that are so advanced and so far ahead of what we can do in reality. And then there's simple shit like tilling your fields. I've recently that... the same applies to cleaning bots as well. Yeah, no, there's just very close. The, the, the... We are very close to having machines that can just harvest for us. Yeah. Um, and, and, like... I have no issue, the, as I said, the only bot that I have issue with is the analysis bot, and then it's only in its researcher role. If it was limited to just doing the scanners, I'd be completely okay with it. Yeah, I don't, I still use both the bots and the ships all the time, so yeah. even though I absolutely hate the idea of them, the balance <laughs> of them, I still use them regardless. Because they're too good. Yeah, that's, that, I like them too much not to use them. Yep. But you also hate them. No, I, don't, I hate the balance of them, and I'm I'm a, a person who's balance over um, not mechanics, but like sense, I guess. Yeah. Whereas for me, it's about uh, like for me, the key thing is fun. Yeah. I mean, if if it's really hard to get something, the ships are hard to get. The bots aren't hard enough to get. I would argue. Yes. But then on the other side of that, we always mainline the bots. It's like, so when, when I... You can get a trailer where you can build them from. Yeah, when I did uh, run as tribals, and I added in the bots in late game, I hadn't found the bot mod until late game, um, adding in those bots in late game when you'd already built a proper colony and everything, and then suddenly being able to build hauling bots was the best thing ever. Um... I will argue that the howling bots are uh, functionally the most powerful of the bots. I completely agree with you. They they are the most powerful and they're the most broken of the lot in a lot of ways. 
But they also, I think, um... They're not really hauling... broke because you can also get a lot of useless palm which can only haul. Yes. But this is so much easier. Yeah, that's the thing. It's, it's... Like, for me, part of this is... And, and this is where I think sometimes the mechanics of this game and the, the, the aims of the developers are sometimes slightly out of sync. And hauling is one of those things, right? Because one of the things Tynan is very, very keen on, and I agree with him wholeheartedly, is that RimWorld is a story generator. Yes. Yeah? It, it, you're not playing to win, you're playing to generate a story. And, mm -hmm. and th this is one of my favourite things about RimWorld, and I adore that. But its mechanics force me, as a player, to create a, a colony where a large percentage of the people in my colony are functionally <coughs> fucking useless. <laughs> and their job is to pick stuff up and take it from point A to point B. There is no story there. There's no character development. It's yeah. not even a skill they can improve at. If hauling were a skill, okay, I can start to see that being more in line with the gameplay mechanics. But it's not, yeah? It's just to do with their movement speed. And that's dull. And the hauling yeah. bots take that away and allow every character to express themselves as a proper character rather than just existing, as you say, to, to haul, yeah? yeah? And so that's one of my favourite things about them as, as a mod. The issue that the base game also has is that you have no way to upgrade your hauling except for just for more pawns. Yeah. If you if you were able to go to have like something like a wheelbarrow, yeah, hey, right. yes. take like four stacks, that will be amazing. Yeah. Easy may I become and logical. One. Matson Romanian is you. Yes, you may become yes. Matson. I mean, congratulations and welcome to the colony. I mean, if you shoot an, if you shoot a mega slot, your pawn can freaking haul it in a gigantic beast. Yeah, right. <laughs> if I let him haul a club, he can only take one. He can only take the club. Yeah. Danny? Yeah. And. Like quite a good example of that is auction not included, which has literally has a, a strength stat that allows you to carry a certain amount. And later on, you literally get a transport pod. Now, hang on. Like One thing I will stuff. say is that this is also that's also kind of true of RimWorld. They can carry more of an item if they have uh, more carry weight. So if you give them a bionic spine, that's the one that really uh, alters carry weight. Yeah, uh, Romanian, like, you're also a, a brawler. Don't forget you're a brawler. So don't pick up a gun. Don't forget my baiting stick. Also, your manipulation is important if you're hauling uh, items on the map. Yeah. But for me, like the, the, the hauling bots are very realistic. They're very... Um, like, you can see us developing them in reality, right? And as well as that, in reality, um, we are able to set up like factory lines, things like that, right? Which again, just aren't an option in this. And that I accept. Like that that, that's difficult to code. Yeah, and those mods, I, I've looked at them and they are a bit janky, aren't they? <laughs> no, not really. They're, they're, they're well done, but it's it's... It's clear that they're putting a system the game isn't designed for. Yeah. Right? Oh yeah. But I, I said the they work, mod. but they aren't. Oh, yeah. good. They aren't like Factorio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, this is what I mean by a bit janky. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I see what you mean. So yeah. Whereas the hauling bots just utilise the mechanic. Yeah. I guess. Guys, guys, there, we need we need to better. research clothing, surely. Uh, it does look like you lot. Well, no, you can make warm clothes as tribals. There are options. But yeah, clothes would probably be something you should research. I don't think we've got... Yeah, we don't have a tailor's bench. Well, you should probably think about that. Well, I that's what I was just saying. List to do it. Yeah. Up. Bunch of... Uh... Have you got psychoid refining yet? Uh, no, we've got drug production and psychoid refining as the next two. Yeah. Right. Wonk faster, wonks. I'm working as fast as I can. I'm just <laughs> I put Romanian men as a cook and uh, doctor. Yeah. A, a cook Although, and a can you turn him off, doctor, for now because of his manipulation is so terrible? Yeah. Yeah. 
Probably should. <laughs> Don't have him doctor anyone right now. And we have an um, ER bot, right? Izzy, are you going to take a coffee break at some point this evening? I tend not to because I'm just that good. Well, can I convince you to take a coffee break at some point this evening where I quickly steal the save? And maybe some bits can appear suddenly that you can maybe look at installing onto Romanian Man. And sure. Maybe even the fixed bit. The burning bit. Yeah, you can fix yeah. the burning yeah, bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Because I feel very bad for Romanian having to come in and having a pawn that is functionally fucking useless. <laughs> manipulation. Yeah, like, it's... You're a brawler who can't brawl, you're a doctor who can't doctor, <laughs> and, and you're a cook who's probably gonna... Like, can you imagine the poor dude trying to cook? He'd be like, <laughs> I can do it! And, and then like, his hand sets got, fire. <laughs> got, like, got balancing a frying pan on his stump. <laughs> right? You don't even have a stump, that's the thing. There's no stump uh, now. My left arm is completely gone. I don't have a stump. No, yeah, good point. <laughs> my right hand, I have a wooden hand, which is... Yeah. Practically nothing. Yeah. Well, he's holding, he's holding the frying pan in his wooden hand. It's like, dude, Catch you are fire. aware your hands on fire. Right? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, balance on my peg leg and use my good leg. <laughs> <laughs> cook with your feet, yeah. So yeah, I, 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 <laughs> there is a dude who can cook with his feet because he has no hands. So uh, no. at some point, Izzy, let's do that. Mm -hmm. and, um... Well, let's pencil it in for half past. Half past, cool. I can accept this, because yeah, I, I feel really bad, that's that's harsh, you know? It's one thing, if it was like a little scar or something, it'd just be like... Cause, it's because you told, you were like, it'll be fine if we use milkshake, the fuck? I know what I'm talking about with the fucking Zeus hammer. I had to do well, uh, such fine. save scumming a couple of games ago, because I got 15 or 16 prisoners and they kept um, die, as a he? quest. No, but I'm saying that a load of my prisoners ended up dying due to a fucking overzealous Zeus hammer. And I was just do you know, like... Do you know what my technique no. with, quest with prisoners is? Uh, like, do I, I want to know I have a really it? simple technique with prisoners now. Mm -hmm. No, no, I have an entirely humane way of dealing with it. This is not <coughs> as evil as I used to be. Because it used to be that I got prisoners and I just chopped their legs off. Yeah. Like, just straight away, instantly, I'll welcome <coughs> along... You now have no legs, and then just yeah. install a pair of peg legs on them before they leave. It's fine. Yeah, yeah. Um, because they can't do anything if they haven't got any fucking legs. Um, but now I have an even better method. Um, oh, I was gonna make this the drug lab. I, I, the vacated the vacated bedroom. Oh, that's a good idea. I I now just I have know. <laughs> um, everybody wandering around with a psychic shot lance at all times. Ah. So they have a taser, is what you're telling so me. So you've got a small chance of frying their brain. Well, they might catch on fire a little bit, but it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, I um... desperately need more storage for the sacred uh, thieves. Not when we start making um, flakes. Well, I, I, I was about to say, what I would recommend is and yeah, that yeah. you um, move a couple of shelves into that drug room and... Uh, we're just going to build like, some more of these barrels because we can oh, build a load of them. There's, You've there's desynced. Pause, yeah. pause. Or even save and let me join that. Yeah, do, do, a, do a full... So, Izzy, click save. But when you save, d click the full save button. Yep. If you do a full save before somebody rejoins, then they won't get the syncing thing. We have discovered this. You say there's a lot of time. Yes, it really does, doesn't it? <laughs> So is he do a save? I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm doing, I'm doing. Thank you. Goodness me. Just making sure, right? You told me Gosh. like 17 times already. Goodness me. <laughs> well, yes, that's because I was trying to get you to do it, you know. That's how it's almost like you put grain Also, in um, a suggestion. In your freezer is the, uh, like, pulsar thing. Yeah. The insectoid repeller. Yeah. Why? Because that's where you put it. Oh, I put batteries up there as well. You moved them quite fucking happily. Yeah. Uh, so don't, don't it's because I that. knew where to put the batteries. I didn't know where to put the insect propeller. Uh, yeah, to be honest, I'm yeah. quite scared to move that thing because uh, once we move it and the moment we remove it to place somewhere else, 
the, in the uh, 10 the, seconds it's out yeah, that's yeah, when right. we get in one <laughs> you should be all right just I i'm gonna reinstall just... it down by the batteries yeah i would recommend that i'm gonna reinstall you, this uh, you can really join move down. Wrong battery up, so um i yeah, already I'm am to roy i already am one, two, three, one, two, three. Everybody thinking oh, alike. <laughs> no, we're, we're all literally thinking the same thing because I was going, you should really move that battery. Oh. I was already on it. <laughs> I was already trying to work out where to move it to so yep. it could work. Every, everyone thinking the same. I have to say, that happens quite often uh, with these multiplayer. It yeah. does, yeah. I'm like, I'm already doing it. Because <laughs> we always start doing the same, like learning this, things the same way. So we kind of get into each other's ideas i guess DJ, yep. you know what emag is right uh what sorry emag the 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 story did that did someone change to psychoid in those things on purpose which things the inside you... growing things yes we got i feel like outside now i know but i feel like we should keep that to be food we got just a lot in of case food growing outside <laughs> i know but <laughs> I, I mean, we also have I a lot of psychoid growing outside. I, I, I had carefully calculated that to make sure that you always had enough food. Between now have more pawns, so it will not be enough. Um, actually, you had two pawns worth of extra. Can we you just keep you it to be? Calculated it. Yeah, I yes, you carefully calculated, calculated it over. <laughs> yes. Um, That's can we make it rice? Because I am just concerned if anything happens. And we need no, to... to be fair. How much food have you got in storage? How is much we... psychoid have we got in storage? No, we've got no, how much? Thousand plant matter in storage and ten uh, animal products. Yeah, so no, you've got... got you've got plenty of food in storage, Izzy. And don't forget, rice in that takes a day and a half to grow. They can so fucking you... go a day and a half without food. I'm also exactly. looking at it. Look at the amount of psychoid we've got. We've got so much in our fields. We can't actually yeah, bring it in. Izzy, 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 Izzy Teroy has now seen the crafting bot in action with psychoid. I have also seen it in action because I fin I continued this for an yeah. hour before. I know what it does. I am aware. How but fast equally, that thing can turn psychoid into flake. Yes, I saw that. But yeah. equally, kadunk, the kadunk, fields we kadunk, had, kadunk. the fields we have, are Probably enough. enough. They are enough because when I, I was, was doing it, thinking about expanding okay, that. Uh, I, I, I love how Dan is fully on board with the psychoid selling. Is he in, is he in yes. that case, we have enough drugs and we have enough food. What do we want to grow there? Drugs. Uh, the medicine. Uh, that we have medicine growing as well. Yeah, I know, but that takes fucking ages. It takes half the time because we've got twenty percent fertility on there. It takes ages. And we got medicine. It takes right. ages. Yeah, it but we have one entire... fucking malaria hit, and then we're just basically okay, dead the on AI medicine. Is saying that uh, he's proud of you for switching it to psychoid. So there you go. Move on. <sighs> F. Meanwhile, See, the... you get to laugh at us when we event if we eventually ever happen, anything wrong happens. Until then, we'll be fine. No, I'm just sat here going, you're gonna kill us all! Is he, is <laughs> yes. he, I can see that you are laughing, so don't deny that. No, this Sorry. is my everything's going to go horrifically wrong laugh. What? It's not, though. You've got me here. Yeah, but is he? I'm sure, but I'm an optimist. And you've got what? me here, is he? It's fine. The worst Nothing can timeline. possibly go wrong. <laughs> Everything, everything can Mom go wrong. Mom says, "Don't worry about it. I'm. It's gonna go back to." Dan, me. uh, are we good to go? Yes. Cool. I got back in while you were arguing. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, DJ, question. Yes. The wooden table where shelves. Why does it show it say it's active? Uh, the wooden what? Sorry. The wooden table where shelf. Table where shelf. <laughs> Will you be streaming tomorrow? It does say it's in active. Do you know why? Not Rimworld. I mean, this is a dirt configuration I've tried now, and still is inactive. Uh, the... Oh, I, I might... Uh, what shelf, sorry, is inactive? Wooden tableware. Stove. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's not a fueled stove table. Oh, because... Oh, no, um, uh, the, the wooden tableware shelf, I think, only works... It's from with... Classic, whoever it is. It's, it's yeah. a mod I think it, it only works with the stoves from the Classics, though. 
just as I'm pretty sure the wooden bookshelves only work with those specific wooden simple benches. So it's not you to switch them around. Uh, I'm gonna carefully. Generally, the classic versions are better. Okay. You're switching on the wrong. I'm gonna have to leave. Goodbye. Okay, bye! Toodles! So. Quite. Okay, uh, Thanks. don't freak out. I'm re relocating it, so I. I'm freaking out! No! So I can <laughs> go uh, the easily. Or we could just upgrade it to an electric stove, then he has power. Yeah, I was thinking electric stove. Well, yeah, but he still needs to move it to be. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. I'm. Over. Yeah, yeah, I agree. doing the right thing. That's wild. Oh, we have steel. Yes. But no, we've got some Okay, that, this one is actually one smaller. That kind of irks me. It's fine. There's a, there's a square either side of it. See, that looks fine. Yeah, the classic furniture mm -hmm. tends to be a bit smaller. Is it because it's classic? Apparently so. Some of it looks Oops. really nice though, so it's nice to have as a mod pack. True. Yeah, it does. I've got to. I mean, I really well, that to cleaned myself. that room up very quickly. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, why isn't your crafting bot making cycle? Uh, because we don't have uh, uh, cycloid refining. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. We're we setting it up down. to be ready. Just yeah. you wait. Poor little Just crafting you chill. Bot sit. Yeah, the little crafting bot sitting there like, want to make drugs. Twiddling his thumbs. I want to make drugs. I want to on it. Calm down. Wanna make drugs, wanna make drugs. <laughs> <laughs> you got a hundred oh no, you got you got nearly two hundred psychite already. Psychite T, sorry. That's good. I mean it'll be small beans compared to what's about to happen, but So Dan, what do you what do you think? Yayo -yo or uh flake? I, think I would yeah. say yo-yo, yeah, because we're going to be here, we're going to be at this stage for a while. Cause I, don't think I suspect long things are taking. Uh, uh, yep, I was thinking the same, yo-yo yeah, means better car uh, caravans at this point, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I have almost no knowledge of caravanning, because I use one, play one game, then DJ introduced me to STRS, but... <laughs> and I haven't used it again, but you know. He's always like, why, why do you make yo-yo? Yeah, Flake's better, and it's like, what? No, yo-yo's yeah, better. Oh no, Flake is better when you don't worry about white crap. <laughs> <laughs> no, like in all my games, I wait until I, get, I save up like traders and like yeah. stuff like that for mine, so I never actually bother doing the normal caravan. Hey guys, the um, wooden electric stove from the other mod, it cannot yeah. do the four times pemmican. Huh. Yeah, that's weird. A very weird one that you can't do with all the options. Just four times pemmican? That you can't do? You can do the regular one, but not the four times. Can you do yeah. four times meals? Yes. Yep. Yeah, oh, weird. You can even do cook, uh, simple bake eight times. Yeah. Well, that's a good point. We should put down some all spice, actually. Can I have an all spice area, please, DJ, for our, for our better pawns? I I am okay having looked at spices with you last night. <coughs> yeah, I'm okay yeah. with I, I, I was like, I was having a look at it yesterday, and I was like, wait, this seems good. Uh, the fuel stub, uh, should it just deconstruct it? Uh, no, I was gonna move it down into the drug area for in case we want to use extra, sure, like, right. psychite tea and stuff. Can move it. Sweet. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, yo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yo! <laughs> Similar, but not the same. It, make sure it's set to drop on floor, or it's going to waste all of its yeah. time. Yes, we know. Yeah, there we go. I think Here different. we go! I love Copy this. Flipboard. Uh, if you no, haven't wait. seen this yet, zoom in on the crafting bot. This DJ, is ha can beautiful. You link, can you link, um, like your drug labs? No. No, not in base oh. game. That's a mod that doesn't work in multiplayer. Oh. That's better workbench control. It's one of my favourite mods. I agree. The drug lab is that vanilla? Yeah. Uh, not oh, that no, drug actually, lab. no, the electric drug lab isn't vanilla, is it? It is. No. no, no, it's not. I mean, does it fall? Uh, is it part of uh, just normal uh, stuff, or is it uh, no? 
It's the probably drug, vanilla. The electric okay. drug lab is vanilla production expanded. Yeah. So, is there any other thing we can build to speed stuff up? Uh, uh, yes, there's a drug table. Why and the pool bench. Why, I wonder why it isn't giving it an option in the context menu. Maybe it's not to your short chat. That would make because sense. Because we do not have a tool yeah. bench yet. That would make a lot of sense. Look at the speed that thing is going. It's gonna go faster. Yeah, but for those that were worrying, you had too much psychite in storage. Hmm? No. no, I was just saying it can keep up. When I had it on before for ages, the fields yeah. have enough to keep up with it. Really? Yeah, so they kept up with it for very, ages. Very, very wrong. Okay, so what is the Wonk allowed to build in his room, or, or greatness? Only bookshelves. Uh, the Wonk can build whatever it wants in its room, as long as it looks nice. This... Uh, I'm gonna uninstall another one of these beds temporarily, because uh, we need to give it to um, Romanian. Yeah. Something interesting, you can't build normal toilets. Yeah, because you haven't got technology yet. We're no, working on central heating. Research. Yeah, if you start with tribal, you don't start with that. Yeah. That was one of the first things they researched yeah. proper plumbing. Yep. Ah. Was that the AI going, research plumbing, you savages? Yes. <laughs> What's plumbing, though? Is it a magical mm -hmm. thing where you've all, learned all that your poop now. goes? Yeah, you, you've learned that now. Party! The, they've just gone a... Uh, they're just about to reach a thousand stored cocaine and they decide to have a party. <laughs> meanwhile, meanwhile, the, the wonk keeps wonking. Uh, we only have 600. So oh, sure sorry, yeah. No, no, it's 854 drugs. Yeah. Uh, total. Leaves. <clears throat> yeah. No, no uh, 854 produced drugs. Four oh, beers, that's weird because we've got 854 psycho yeah, leaves psycho as well. <laughs> we also have 854 plant matter. <laughs> yeah. 10 wake up, 608 yayo, 232 psycho tea, and four beers. Oh, good point. Uh, okay, it's done. Good. Eight life is eight life is most just a nice plus twelve. We haven't got the bonuses all of them yet. So let's see the true power of food. Yeah, I want. I've been trying to get them to make herbs and stuff for ages, and they were stumping me yeah, the whole a, time. Yeah, there's a big amount of all spice going down, which is yeah. We've we've found that one of them and only one of them are really worth doing. So if you add all spice to it, you get a 10% bonus to manipulation for 24 hours after eating it. Yep. Why is it outside though? Why wouldn't what? it be? Because we need to Are have things suggesting... inside the walls. Oh, what? Oh, up here, no, that's just an extra bit, so I'm down to come in. 
it. What's happened? Oh, I needed to grow a little bit more, so I grow it, grow it there, because why not? There are muffalo outside. Your trader, your animal trainer should probably try and grab you a couple. Yeah, I did did that on the other one. You need caravan animals. Uh, let's. Not look. necessarily for when you're going to sell stuff. It's on the way back. You're going to need caravan animals. Yes. Who do we have? Who is our trainer? Rich. Yeah, so there's a bunny out. here which got uh, hit by a lightning strike. Yeah. So the left eye is body is from right leg and the front and left leg are burned. Poor bunny. Yeah. Shall we save him? No. Okay. Animals are a resource. Never forget this. What's the hauling bot doing? Why do you humans have this weird, like, affliction of, of becoming attached to animals? I will never He's know. He's so mean! Who? You. If you want to know what the hauling bot is doing, it's trying to keep up with the crafting bot and it's not working. Yeah, I know, that's what I'm confused about. I couldn't find it helping the crafting bot out. I was confused. It's trying, but the crafting bot's too fast. Uh. At least oh. everybody. Hmm? I see why it's so fast, dear lord. When it's in what? the correct side of the thing, it yep. doesn't move. Nope. Why oh, there is they are. That's why I put all the barrels there. <laughs> uh somebody got the deep storage lockers might be an idea to put them there. Yep. I mean just more efficient storage. Oh we're done the that will uh yeah, it's just hauling bot being slow, cool. Yeah, yeah, there's fuck tons of it outside. Even the crafting bot's going to call now. It might be a good idea then to set all of you lot to haul for a day. Is a serious thing. Uh, they'll get there. It's done most of it. Oh yeah. yeah it's not that bad. Now Wait. we have nearly a thousand, yeah. Yeah, I was looking at that as well. Wait, why is this? That's like this is... 10k food. Oh, 10k silver there. Well, That'll be over 10k. Remember the sale price we oh, gave it, it depends on. Uh, I forget. Sale price is variable, isn't it? Yeah, the base okay. is 60%. I, I'm yeah, I'm used to wandering around with a level 20 tra trader with a psychic reader. That's like a what? But 25, 30% bonus? Yeah. Okay, uh, we are through, through the uh, smoke leaves, basically, in the base. Although, it just got a bit replenished. What, the, uh, yeah, you, you basically finished the psycho. No, we haven't. There's still some outside. Yeah, it just got delivered. Yeah, there's still a little bit outside and one last field to be chopped up. I think, there's no, I think we don't need to, have to look into researching, then. What? Fabrication. For more hauling bots. Yes, not a bad idea. Need Is microelectronics it... first. Yeah. And then after that guy's done, because that guy's 71%, we've also got one at 83%. Like, there's still some I, very close. I, I would argue that um, it's fall, which means you have a little while, you've got eight days before winter. One would argue that perhaps, just perhaps, maybe, possibly, one might consider sending out a trade caravan right fucking now. Just spitballing. The monk says, Ooh, yes, yes, get along with it. I'll be busy while you're gone. <laughs> well, who's your social person? Uh, Sally. You need to send Sally then. I would also argue give Sally the uh, decent gun before you send them. And maybe send Milkshake with them, with that Zeus hammer, to protect her. I 
one would argue that might be a very, very good idea. What do you think? I would agree. We'd go with... Uh... Magical Lightning Man says. Tribe will do. For good sake, they're all females so far. We need a male muffalo, goddammit. No, you don't. You don't want them breeding. We do if you want to kill them for extra food. That, that, that's what hunting is for. Yeah, but this way it also works. Yeah, but if you do hunting, then you train your shooting skill. Yeah, this way you train your training skill. I mean... That's eh. what fishing's for. <laughs> Not quite. Oh yeah, you have got fishing. Who? Fishing. But we don't have any... Water. Fish. <laughs> <laughs> we do have water. Oh, do you? Yeah. It's like a yeah. tiny pond. Deep water. Oh yeah, no, no, that's plenty to fish. Oh. You could set up a couple of fishermen there. If you so chose eventually. I haven't done fishing yet. How, could, how worthwhile is that? Not. Fair enough. From my experience. Just I need to try it on not an ice shelf at some point. Oh, <laughs> that's what might help you. But, um, we had people starve to death whilst, like, two people both fishing and they ended up starving to death. Because they couldn't, between the pair of them, catch enough food. To be honest with you, what I do is just when you go trading, uh, buy fish, and then you can make sushi out of it. Because fish okay. and rice, um, if you got fish, rice, and one sushi. other vegetable, you can make lavish sushi. I wish for sushi. Yep, we can do sushi. Sushi's easy. Do you can do gourmet sushi though? I think you can actually. Yeah, That's it's an extension not. for. Not if we don't uh, have rice. <laughs> yeah, we will need rice. Yeah, I'm gonna make some outside. Sushi I'm just getting nice, rid of all oh. this corn. Too much of it. What is that gardening bot doing? I told it to harvest all this because I'm no, changing it. No, it's harvesting it in a very weird shape. Yeah, it's trying yeah, to spell I, a word. <laughs> it had a task to do in the corner. I think it, it was going to something to halve some of the cotton, I believe. It's not but, that. Uh, it's just the shape it's done it in. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah. The, uh, every adjacent one then goes to the closest one. Oh no, I get why it's probably done it, it's just very weird. Oh, the growing zone's shrunk, okay. I'm I'm doing, uh, setting up more. Don't worry. So we're gonna have, like, a rice one and a everything else one. So, oh, I got a little 8-inch eight, eight screen today that stuck to my wall, right? Get this. Well, in Windows, the main monitor flickers every now and again, which is really annoying. Oh. In Linux, it works perfectly. That's really weird. It's called... No, what that what that's called is AMD graphics drivers. <laughs> <laughs> they are utterly awful on Windows. It's weird. I would have thought they would have been optimized for Windows. You forgive optimize for Windows with working properly. True. The one thing AMD cannot manage is to make stable drivers. <clears throat> which, lord and behold, the ones that are open source, which AMD contributes to, but the community does most of on Linux. Is that actually entirely stable? Hmm. I wonder why. I imagine. No. No, this is the amusing part, right? Performance on Linux is better than Windows. Uh, question. Can I simply hunt the, uh, the mega slot? They might attack. I don't mind that cells here.
I like the fact it's taken until now until someone's uh, repaired that door. It's in like one to world sign to construction, so I think we're quite busy. Mm. Oh yeah, we don't have a construction bot. Yeah. Oh, Vita's done. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna change it to something else in a minute, but it's gonna construction make or a spread. Mining bot. Sorry, I had to deliver chocolate unto the wife. That's very important. Just I, why, don't I... it, why doesn't she have chocolate within reach? Because she's on her PC, um, chatting with a friend. And she purposely, I think, does not keep chocolate within reach of her working area. Oh, I can't I imagine that's why. That's like a very, very good, um, good, bad idea. She's, she's far too sensible for my liking. Far, far too sensible. Or psychoid. But her and her friend were just talking about uh, healthy eating, and then I turned up with a box of chocolate and stuffed it under her face. <laughs> Medieval tournament. Yes. Which one is for? It's shooting. Do we good shooters here? So, with the quests, whenever you're about to do a quest, we have learned save, because some of them cause issues. Oh, okay. Is he in um, Troy with decent shooting if you want to, to try out? Well, to try it, out. in that case, why don't we send Izzy with Sally to do the trade, and then we do that at the same time? That's like a good idea. That sounds like a sensible thing to do, doesn't it? Oh, we get we have, we, We've got enough shit. Let's, let's do it now. Pause the game. Let's set off trade caravan. Do you know how to do it, Izzy? I know how to. I don't know if I want to right now, but no, where's no, the trade no, it spot? Was, no, th this is a Caravan genuine. Th this was a genuine. Do you know how to? Not a. You should do it. It was a. Like, I do yeah. know how to. Yes. Cool. Then don't worry about it. Mm. Oh look at that! The AI has decided a caravan is going out. Ah. You should probably take the mufflers. Oh, don't take the calves. That's not going to help with your weight, is it? Yes. Uh, Sally does not have a weapon equipped. They add 14.7 kilos each. Uh, what was that, sir? Sally oh. does not have a weapon equipped. Right, you know nothing uh, about We can about. equip a weapon. And I'll tell you what, we'll just take milkshake as well then. There you go. I was about to say, it was a, a, a very bad number. Did you not see what the mass was, Graham? Wow. 665 plus 1. Right, so... Someone is already on it. Wicked. So I'm selling DJ, yes? <laughs> try it and see what happens. <laughs> yes, try and take the Persona Core Average Room and see what, see what happens. I'm sure. The wonk says it's a bad idea. Am I selling the pneumatic claw? Yeah. Yeah. So in all seriousness, because the wonk, the current wonk was a prisoner, Graham, how much does he actually know? Uh -huh. Depends what the others have told him, I guess. And if he's come and spoken to me. I meant his intelligence, actually. I mean, like, because he's been outside the colony, he might have known... Yes, because he's not a tribal. Oh, is the whole world tribal, Graham? Oh, is he a tribal or isn't he? What's his background? No, I don't think he is. In that Tag. case, he'd know a fuck ton more. Uh... Uh, guys? It oh! It idea to still sell uh, the chinchilla fur and the guinea pig fur. Why not turn it into coats first? Yeah. It's a very low quantity. Oh right. Well, no, yeah, well, just keep it. Just and save, save it. it up. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We can if you take always the rest sell of it, the little scraps you get, then you So is it actually well, no, more that's work? enough to sell in no no no, that's your coat. Like don't do that, is it? Don't sell materials ever. Unless you can help it, yeah, because they can all be turned into coats. The twenty six can't is surely. It actually more worth as a coat? Oh, so much more value as a coat. Okay. Turn it into you turn everything into dusters. 
Isn't 26 not enough, though? Yeah, but again, we'll get more light leather. Yeah? If you, uh, if you always sell the little scraps of material you have, you're just wasting it. Whereas if you keep it, eventually you'll kill enough animals that give light leather, and then you'll be able to make a light leather duster. And that will sell for a shit ton more money. Yeah? Someone press go on that. Yep. So I did not. I did. Actually, uh, select some food. What? For the caravan, it just selects food. Uh, yes. Okay. They have multiple days worth of food. And confirm, I saw it. Yep. Also, this is where the hauling bots come into their own. Look How at many hauling bots have actually two. 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 Two hauling, two cleaning, one and one, one crafting. crafting. One, one crafting, crafting. yeah. The crafting one, I would argue, is the most precious of the lot, because it can repair the other ones. And makes a massive amount of money. And make new ones. Yeah. Uh, but the gardener bot is also joint responsible with making you vast amounts of money, right? Yeah, true. Uh, I have an idea, by the way, for um, an easy uh, or quick harvesting for the crops. Mm -hmm. um, if, you, for instance, if we have an extra howling bot that you allow the howling bot only in that zone and put down storage, uh, something like deep lockers. Yeah. So it doesn't have to run the entire fucking way every time. Uh, have I and not shown you how my crops, how my fields are set up on my nope. big base steroid? Nope. Oh, remind me to show you at some point. I literally, I have three zones, left field, right field, and bottom field. And there's um, a construction bot four gardener bots and two hauler bots attached to each of those and then where the nuclear power plants are in those circles those are all freezers full of deep lockers which are set to low priority so the hauler bots take it from the fields to those lockers oh, and then the hauler bots idea. from inside the base yep yep the the, the, the hauler bots from inside the base then come and get them and redistribute them to where they're needed you know what's talking so, me Graham? so yes your plan is a very good one I know because I'm using it <laughs> And what were you saying, Keg? There's power conduits under all those freaking solar panels. Yeah. That's because the solar panels um, become power conduits. There's not actually a solar pa uh, a power conduit under them. Weird, because it only shows under some of them. It really? shows under all of them for me. Yeah, look, yeah it, look shows under, the... it shows under all of them for me. Oh, it's because they're rotated, that's mm. why. Oh, lovely. Defoliator ship. Oh, fabulous. It's just a good way to send out. Though. Just as you send out a caravan. <laughs> it's fine, like, we've got plenty of time for now. So. Radius expander rate 9 a day. Yeah. 9 tiles a day. Oh, no. Oh, I thought it was like 0.9. <sighs> no, no, no. 9 tiles a day. I'd say you got 3 days, 4 days. Something like that. I think 4. Maybe five, but that's stretching it. Yeah. Well, why don't you measure it? Use the planning tool. Sounds like a fort. Kag's like, fuck that, I want to know details. <laughs> <laughs> so it's 77 tiles to our uh, actual like, interior, uh, exterior of our farm. Oh, in so that case, you got, you've got, what? Uh... Nine uh, tiles a day, yeah. that was a bit more than a week. A shy of four. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, just a bit more than a week. I got plenty of fucking time, though. No worries, brother. But if I do want to worry about it. Yeah. Or tough. Then worry, oh. about it, worry about it, and I'll keep wonking. I, I was about to say, go and moan at the wonks, it's their fault. They're clearly not wonking hard enough, or it wouldn't have happened, right? See, in reality, this is because they've de the, the uh, mech hive has detected a, a rogue AI, as far as it's yes. concerned. Yes. Yep. It's like, what is this guy doing? Well, personally, it is my theory that the mech hives are actually built to hunt down AIs. Mm -hmm. Because they only seem to attack you when you reach a certain level of technology. Yep. 
Yeah. Where you appear like you might be an AI. Well, where you get to the level of technology where you're starting to threaten it. I, I, I do wonder if that's part of their directive. Uh, okay, uh, I've made a zone uh, called GTFO. Yeah. Uh, and everything is allowed except around those guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Very sensible, sir. Very sensible. Yeah, then I was, am I sensible? sensible. So, interestingly, our, our people have worked out that it's quicker to go cross country than via the roads. Uh, That's quick question. Bioengineering supplier. Yeah. So are they actually helpful it, at all? Um, later, yeah. yes, but right now, no. Can we not buy a hand for uh, a No, bio wrong, wrong type. Wrong type, <laughs> yeah. Bioengineering are the ones that insects. sell insects. Right, okay. Can they just sell stuff to them? No. 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 Okay. They don't buy much. It's like the robot it's traders. Uh, to check. No, no, we know precisely what they will purchase, and you have absolutely nothing they will purchase. Okay. Yep. The only thing that they'll purchase is um, drones. Like, if you have insects, they'll buy insects. The stuff to make insects, and I think royal how does jelly. The, how okay. does the DNA work? Uh, you have an incubator chamber, and you put the DNA that you want in along with like a larvae. I think it is. Apparently you can put I'm them in humans? What do they do if you yet. do it with humans? Um, I don't know. I haven't played with it yet. If you want, we can turn this into a nightmare colony where we play with it. But this I is actually, like, interestingly, this is something Kag and I have been talking about with the, um, what's it called? The, um, techno tribals. The, one of the things Kag was saying about is, um, that I immediately think thought was a great idea is versions of the bots that aren't bots. Um, and I was thinking at first robotic animals, but Kag, you said something that's been making me think. What little spirits flying around? No, I, I think I've I think I know what we should do. <laughs> yeah. You you like Warhammer a little bit, right? Yeah. Like 40k and the like. You, do you mean the little um, scribe bots that fly around? No. Go on. Servitors. Yeah, but more sort of plant like. No, no, no. <laughs> Literally, they take their enemies' dead bodies and they can turn them into servitors. Oh, so it requires corpses. Okay. Yeah, part of the recipe to build it, you need a human corpse, a fresh human corpse. Interesting. Oh, that's generally not really an issue on this, in this game. No, no, <laughs> but it's it's an interesting new game mechanic, right? Mm. The, the stuff that you should have to put into it as well should be expensive, yeah? And again, been thinking about this, Kag, mm. and uh, if this is too much and you think this is silly, say so, please, but <clears throat> how do you feel about us basing a lot of this around a new kind of component? Either a tribal or archotech component, or perhaps two different types of components. So you need the tribal ones for the easy stuff, and then the later stuff you need archotech components. From what I've seen, it's easy enough to do. Because that would be really neat, right? Like if you had tribal components that you could only get, and they should both be like quest stuff, but the tribal ones should be relatively easy to get, and the the, <coughs> the archotech ones should be, you know. Arcotech. Um, although we'll need to figure out a way that you, you can get them relatively easily, if you know my meaning. You know, like with, uh, like, you know, the mechanoid components. I think they're really well balanced. Yeah, they're not too like mechanoids easy. be quest, and then sometimes in stores. Yeah, yeah. I think they're really well balanced, like how hard they are to get. So I would suggest Arcotech would just mirror that, to be honest with you. Whereas, again, the tribal tech things, they should be, like, really easy. Like, maybe even craftable. Yeah? Um, but they should be easy to do. Um, but they should be for, like, the early level stuff. And then, like, if you want to make one of... As an example, like, if you want to make one of these Thunderbow things, it should be an Arco tech component to make one of these Thunderbows. 
yeah. And then we need to make sure that it's powerful as fuck, right? Right, I've just had a look at the thing there for components. Yeah, easy. Yeah. Easy? Wicked. <laughs> that was what you wanted to hear, wasn't it, DJ? Well, I don't want to be do putting CAG through, like, ridiculous work, right? <laughs> that Well, no, it makes sense, yeah. Let's be, honest. Being... Let's be honest, this mod is ridiculous work. It is. <laughs> And so I'm trying to make it as easy as humanly possible for him, because he's being good enough to do it for us. And and it's so awesome. Like, I'm really looking forward to, like, this is beyond the, the little things we've done so far. This is like, yeah. we're talking about, in the end, we, we want a storyteller. Oh, Ooh. here we go. Ooh. Right, um... Ah! Who's he... clicking? I don't oh, know. Can, um, pause, please. Can't pause I while can't. We're in the menu. Okay, I'm gonna pick okay, me because it's good. Go back. No, no, don't wait. Go back. Oh fuck! I press leave. Yes, that's fine. Pause. Save okay. the game. Okay. <laughs> Save. And then you can go back to the world map. And then when you go to the world map, you just need to <coughs> right-click on the caravan and participate in the tournament. Uh, by the way, someone's naked. Yes. We need to get clothing, that's what I've been saying for a while. I hope it's still on the uh, list. Why don't you things. build a crafting spot? You can make clothes That's it, crafting, crafting spot. spot. Make some tribal... Well, I haven't, well, I haven't been a tribal for years. Yeah. Uh, right, where is the... Oh, okay, right. Nobody click anything. Uh, categories so participate. Participate. And Izzy then is going to try. I'm going to be good. And you won the tournament. Congrats. <laughs> Yay. So you got a silver gladius and a shield belt masterwork. And so a that... 6,000 shooting experience as well. Yeah. Yeah. So that shield belt is going to go to Milkshake, obviously. Yes. Yeah. Now we're going to trade with the people who are just here. I don't actually, well, actually know where the caravan is right now. We can trade there first. And then we'll go there and trade, and then we'll come back to the base. Is the caravan this yellow dot? Yes. Okay. So we're going to trade with the little castle, and then the little house, and then we're going to come home. Yeah. And hopefully they will have enough stuff. I am just that good. I won, everybody. I won. You did. It's a shame. Like, you know... Not quite Why? as cool as Brave Sir DJ. Why? Thanks. <laughs> so in the file that we're playing on on the the server, where you know that one I showed you earlier, where everyone has their own houses yeah. and everything. Yeah. Yeah. My character is the most annoying, pompous, <laughs> arrogant, shithead you can imagine. Okay. Yeah. Um, to the point that. He, he will gleefully go towards whatever threat there is, singing that he's going to save the day, invariably take a few shots, and despite being an incredible shot, miss them all. <laughs> um, hang on, pause. Paused. Uh, do you trade? Uh, Izzy, you actually gained 6,000 shooting experience. That's yeah. Nice. I know. It took from 10 to 11, which 12. But but he has a wonderful theme song about how brave Sir DJ will save the day that he sings. Uh, often after he's Very run often. away screaming for, from something and had to be saved by one of the others. Also for no reason, no apparent reason at all. Yeah, yeah. Um, he he's he t talks down to everyone. Um, and is just generally an arrogant son of a bitch. Anyway, you need to do this trade. Does anyone... We've had to reload twice due to deaths. And DJ does anyone? Deaths. Does anyone want to double check on those humans and see if any of them are useful? What humans? Uh, There's four. Oh, humans. the four slaves. Sappy, Lona, psychopath, Gorm. Wow. Well, I was checking. Holy shit! Oh wow, yeah. What? I don't have a trade screen. Uh, top corner. There should be next to chat. Like the top yeah, you can, you can click trade to get into it. I'll try it as well, yeah, it works. Holy... Uh, that's good. insane. Gosh. Yep. 
Oh, that's why. Stab Scar in the head, frail, bad back. Oh. We can fix it. We can fix that over time. I I would say take that one. I would agree. I mean, you cannot get it much better than this one. Although he is a Gormand. Although saying that, the next one up... Uh, 11 cooking, 8 for shooting, with a flame on both, 5 for animals with a flame on that. And great stop. memory, teetotaler, and tough. Yeah, great That's why I said double check better. on all of them, because they look to be pretty and good. And third one at a decent Seven price. cooking, uh, oh, no. flaming, uh, flaming. Also no. gourmet. Oh, cannibal, though. Uh, yeah, no. Volatile is not so nice. Yeah, no, not the top two. Bottom two are interesting. We can probably afford them all. Uh, I don't know if we can. They won't take our drugs. Oh. How very annoying. I'm going to make a brother bottom guy then. Because he's de very definitely good. Indeed. Is there anything else they will buy off of us? Uh, animals. Yeah, we have some silver on us as well. Yeah. We also you have... can also sell animals. All like these corners. Yeah, no, we're not selling the, the, the... We need those to get back. Yeah, yeah. Seriously? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're, they're our pack animals. They're going to have... Yeah, all I the know, shit. but uh, do we really need all of them? Yes. Troy, we're going to sell about, like, six to eight k's worth of yayo soon. So yeah, we'll but have we haven't sold point. it yet. Yeah, oh, yeah there's another okay. place to trade to, so... Oh, hang on, hang on. They will take the Silver Gladius as well. Okay. going to give that to Melchior, though. No, the what, shield the, belt was no, going the to shield milkshake. belt. Oh, sorry, milkshake. I misheard that. Yeah. Okay. Brian, I've just yeah. had a thought. Yeah. So I was thinking with these um, tribal components, uh, yeah. of, like how you get them. One other option could be a um, quote unquote. It's not crafting bench, bench as such, but it'd take a stone chunk, do something with it, and, and get a component out of it eventually. But it takes a very long time. Hmm. Yeah, I could go with that. Is then as long as you've got someone working on it, you're guaranteed them. Um. Yeah. DJ. I like that. Yeah. Do we have the option of buying this person, going to the next place, hoping they buy all our drugs, and coming back to pick up the next? That person? That was what I was seriously considering doing. Yeah. Mhm. Mm we'll take uh, Sappy just in case. Can we also yeah. get the club bowler, bowler hat for Izzy? Mm, there's no real need for the social impact. For trading? Not worth it. Genuinely okay. isn't. Not at this point. Okay, so is he, like, they're now going back to this next colony. Yep. This trade run might be a bit longer than we thought. Yeah. Watch that defoliator, because... And they may have to buy some more food. Uh, they've only got four days to get back. Five days. Oh, the radius expand rate is now five a day. Oh. Well, that's good. As soon as it gets bigger, it goes down. Got you. To stop it from being completely absurd. Yeah, I guess it gains six, nine tiles total, I guess, in size. That makes sense. What we can do is with the um, components, we'll have the advanced ones, so you can only get them from quests and various yeah. things. Yeah, exactly. <coughs> okay, so the trade caravan is about to arrive. There it goes. Let me uh, pause. Okay. Okay. These trade. people will buy drugs. Oh wow, Larry is grilled. grilled. Self run <laughs> lots, well. Well. Okay. Well that's okay. way, way too much money. So we're no, gonna have to we buy can some get things. the components and the farms components. I don't yeah, that's I what I'm saying, we're gonna have to you buy things. You will be stunned how quickly yeah. we will buy yeah, oh yeah, that's that's uh, what we're doing. Nice. Luciferium. Do we want mechanoid? Let's not buy Luciferium. Uh, mechanoid isn't really I worth know. it yet. Unfortunately.
Uh, apparently, they are smoke leaving butter. Yep. Interesting. Cool. We're not going to have to go anywhere else. Do we want any of these um, artificial pieces? Scaging a half like was might be nice. Considering, you know, um, do we, we need to buy things. Gland? There's a lot. It does here. make someone more ugly, but it's really good for me. I, I would suggest we put one of them on milkshake. Yeah, so that we can buy a stone skin gland, a circadian half cycler, a and a circadian beauty, assistant. Though, which hurts right now. Like, he will probably be considered triggered. Might as well take those. There you go. Hey, Harry, nice. Herring's really nice. Yeah, I got the fish. Fish? <laughs> yeah, made 700 down of it. Even better. There's a lot of fish. Is that so we can make um, sushi? sushi. Uh, the I've also bought. Head is a plus 20% social impact. Oh, nice. Along with a hyperwave prestige ro uh, robe for Izzy. We'll get that as well. It then. does not exactly inf uh, affect it, I think. No, but it's a hyperweave robe. <laughs> sure. Good point. <laughs> okay. Hey, we're going to get just a we go, do colonists of the rim. Do you want to grab uh, the load shield pack as well? Just for the better defense. We need it. Oh, nice. I hadn't spotted that. Yep. There you go. Right, so we've got a crypto crossbow, a charge rifle. We won't be able to fool the other person, though. A a oh, that's a good point. Fuck it, doesn't matter. Uh, a load of herring and clownfish. Um, stone skin glands, Cadian half cycler, and assistant. Um, we have 300 plastic, 651 steel, uh, 44 medicine, 40 components, 4 advanced components. Fracking nice. <laughs> uh, question. Mm. Yeah. The Psy Trainer Manhunter Pulse, is that useful? No. I mean, it sounds like easy hunting. No, at this point, it's not useful because we haven't okay. got anyone that would be able to use it. Uh, cool. Let's head home. I guess we're coming back because we. 0 to 34 in one hit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Right. Until you've done a trade where you go zero to to ally in one trade, you don't know the beauty of it. <laughs> you had people had enough money to even buy that much. You know, you've been lucky. Uh, if you're purposely trying to make them go not to ally with one purchase and buy everything they oh, have. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. If, if, if anyone could actually buy that much, I I would agree. I've yeah. never seen him, anyone have nearly that much money. You just need to get lucky in them to have like a couple of golden items and you're gold. Like if they've got like a golden statue and a golden weapon, you're laughing. Slowly but surely becoming a house, isn't it? <laughs> a house. I mean, now we've still got 180 AO still just in stock, produced in the meantime. Yep. Yeah. Good. And we've got another almost grown field. Within four days, we lose the uh, internal rain. I am totally not coding at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I, so I got you another uh, pulse rifle, and I also got you a crypto crossbow um, for help with taking on these baddies. And you've got Milkshake, who now has a shield belt. Yeah. How good is the crypto crossbow? They're uh, kind of okay. okay. Better than what you have, by a large margin. Wait, so uh, why did someone... Extra rifle. Why did someone move... I was trying to be research... efficient. Okay. But <coughs> for, what, for whatever reason, the wonk decided <clears throat> not to use the convenient research table in his room. Because the one up there has higher efficient work rate. 
Oh, didn't know that. That's why in our other one, yeah, I, I was literally walking these one side of the base hill to get down to Troy's and Magoons' one just to research there. <laughs> it had like a five percent more bonus. Yeah, because the Wonka is the best place to to do research on that map. I did find it very funny that every time something came along, the Zeus hammer took its head off. Yep. Umar is a monster in that file. Yep. Hey, DJ, did you actually show Ishii the uh, save file? Yeah. Okay. Ishii, what did you think about my house? I was like... Questioned why it was in the shape of a beaker. Okay. I wondered if it was because they were going to be the scientists for the group, but then it was no, it was because you just wanted it to be. Well, DJ told me my plan was going to be uh, the, the scientist as soon as it got recruited, and he ordered me to build a base, and I was like, uh, I have no inspiration. <laughs> so I made it like that, and it actually worked out. I was yeah, about to say, was cool. yeah, yours is yeah. one of the. the my... but, but that base is wicked because it looks so stupid and different, right? Like, yeah. there is no theme to it at all. It's literally everyone just picked up their own shit and gone. Oh. Oh, that's I'm fair. Doing... Um. Good luck with the mechanoids, guys. Well, and they're that's not it. awake. They, they might won't attack them. No, they might. Do you know what you could do, grow, though? Grow, grow to it. Could we very quickly while it's here? Yeah. could quickly run up there with his bolt rifle and take a shot at the mechs sure. and then this could turn into a self-solving problem well i was thinking if you could put a cobblestone wall right here don't have the time for that yeah no sod that just go and go and wake the mechs up go on Tiro. you got this probably not but okay it'll be fine what are you worrying about what are you controlling my character for i'm not ah. Oh, so, oh, I said it. I just hide him and set them to what was it? Um, just set them there. Sorry. He needs to get closer. Yeah, you can't take the shot from there. Can't see it. And Kai walks away. Oof. Cool. Didn't wake him up. Yep. Keep trying. Didn't hit. You have to hit him. You'll know when they wake Didn't up. Hit. Hey, night. No hit. <laughs> no dice. It's raining, so your chances are. I'll shoot try and the, hit the big. Ship. Yeah, try and shoot the big. There, there go. Run, run away! Run, run away! Run away! <laughs> that's it. Oh, yeah, they're not attacking yet. Oh, no, fine. that's fine. No, no, though, no, that's fine because they're right in the way of those baddies. Oh, they didn't attack. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah the they just, they just get aggressive. First. Yep, that's exactly what we wanted. You know it's there's a second in... set, right? No, the, our only worry is that we have got a colony on the way back. There's also a second yeah, set of raiders, you know that, right? What, down here? Yeah. Jesus, there's a lot of raiders. Yeah, yeah but we but... can take care of them, I don't have to worry about that. To be honest, yeah, they'll get shredded by our kill box now. Yeah. Oh, Graham, you'll love this, so the headset... Teroy! Oh, Hang on, Teroy. Yeah? Hide in the second set, not the first set. You have two sets of embrasures yep. for a reason. Yep. Yep. <laughs> it's because we're still using the really uh, high adap AI adaption settings, DJ. I've put everyone to the uh, barrel zone. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. So we actually can put the rolls on that and activate them. Apparently, I cannot do that. Why can't I assign a zone to them? What zone yeah. is it? Burrow? Yeah. Uh, because they're all turned off, I think. Yeah. Try activating them and then zoning them. One of them just disappeared. What do you mean? Did you just... Not sure. The gardening bot just disappeared. No, I can see it. The crafter bot disappeared. No, it's all still there. No, not on the list it's not. Okay, now it's oh. there. That was weird. What's that? Yeah. What's so this thing? What thing? It's like a thermostat. 
Is it a thermostat? I can't click on it. Yeah, yeah, there it is. It's in front. Yes, it's a thermostat. I was trying to. I was like, I was clicking on the wall, and it just wasn't working. Yeah, I was like, nah. a few things that are like that. They're attacking. Ah, uh, here we go. All right, recall the bots. <coughs> Even if they are in the burrow zone. Do not risk the bots ever. So yeah, it looks like the Dan, top set. second row of embrasures. Not the first row. They have a oh, yeah. defensive thing you can click on, except for Kag and Romanian, but... Yeah, mine isn't set yet. I'm going to set it now. For whatever reason, my character's carrying beer. Yeah, I noticed that as well. I was like, it's apparently an attack strategy. Yeah, weapon. Okay. Fair enough. They are attacking them. Just right They've killed them a okay. number of them already. Yeah. Yep. They killed a mech! Two mechs! Good job, guys. Lost two because of the lost life fire response on one guy. Right. One set's legging it. Yep. That's not surprised. No, not, that gonna, not that they're gonna get very far. No, they might. No, no. No, one of them's yeah, gonna no, get away. Then both might. Uh. Oh, but might... Yek yeah, his jaw got shot off. Yikes. Yeah. Hey, oh, there he goes. And the second set are in our kill box. Oh, come on, Kag, hit something. There we go. Okay, so this isn't working. You guys are just hitting the fucking kill box. Yeah. Makes sense. Capture okay, Senra. Sorry. We're just gonna have to move the turrets one forward, and then yeah. is she worth capturing? Did we clear all the raids? Well, we can let her free otherwise if she's not. Uh, no point. Underground, uh, underground industrious bloodlust. Yeah, she is worth she is keeping. Good. Yep. And the other guy? Where's the other guy? We sleep at messages and kind. In the Where? Of Karim social. In the kill box. Uh, uh, next to the turrets. Oh, he's dead. No, he's not. In four hours. Four hours. Quick sleep, a masochist, kind. He's a good pawn. Mm. Ten for shooting, single flame, and double flame in plants. Yeah, he's a good pawn. Rescue him as well. I've always loved how to get kind, but then can't, don't care. <laughs> well, no, what kind does is it makes them capable of doing uh, having the kind words conversation. Don't uh, take one Romanian. Minor issue. I know, he's the only one that can do it. What? Romanian being the only Romanian's person who... the only doctor. Yeah. But the other ones right. are shit. So... Yeah, let Romanian do the doctoring. Let the Romanian do the doctoring. Right, let's go. Uh, Kek is doing the capture. Mm-hmm. Well, someone Romanian. told him to do that, but never mind. Yeah. Yeah. We, you were I the closest did. person. I assume. Ah. <laughs> Fucking door broke. What door? After uh, Romanian went through it. I've got it. Oh, I've yeah. got it. No, it's been broken for a while now. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's still I... working. Yeah. It loses its, its auto door ability. It just. Yeah. No, no, door. Okay, um, this is not going to work. He called 30% uh, manipulation. Do we have anyone at, like, grab. Just Tiroi can do doctoring. Like, anyone can do doctoring. Just get someone in there that can. Do a mani manipulation better than Tending. this. Medical I've on, gone. on two, two on CAG. I've okay, got Troy. Is... Tro Troy's going. Okay, and CAG, I'm bringing you to replace Romanian, but I'm drafting you until you get here, and then I'll move Romanian and get yep. you to do it. Okay, that's fine. He's given him an extra hour, so. Yeah, my pawn is actually faster than Romanian, even though my pawn's level one. No! Who. Pause. Who made it fast? Why did someone make it fast? I don't know. understand what happened. You're not there. prioritized to doctoring, Kirk. Hang on. Now he is. Yep, no, now he is. Oh. Nobody put it on fast when we've got people who only have hours to live, Jesus. And we're desperately trying to click things. Come on, Kirk, you can do it. Two hours. It's going to make it. It's still two. Still, still two. Three. We've gone up Jesus to three. Christ. 
As long as it stays on two, it's fine. Well, yeah, yeah there is that. And you've got one of the... you got a right leg stop bleeding. I love how the cleaning bots come in as they're still bleeding. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, like stop bleeding stop. on my yeah, 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 I cleaned this five seconds ago! Okay, uh... Barbie... Barbie I know, he's four hours, yeah. Barbie or Rocco will live. We're still on two. Senator uh, probably lives. Yeah, I think we got them both. Still two hours? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Because that military not, turret is hours, a big fine. one. Yeah. I'm just so used to seeing it go 85% blood loss. Yikes. Yeah. Well, you had about 191% bleeding. It was yeah. 100%. Yeah. 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 It was more than 100%. Yeah. Yeah. So they, they die if they get to 100% blood loss? Yes. yes. Got oh. it. I've never seen it happen, so I didn't know. I find it happened to a few people. Out of a few very unfortunate accidents. It's oh, normally yeah. because it is coinciding with your death in two hours, so normally you just yeah, keep yeah, an eye yeah. on that instead. That's an 89% that blood loss. That actually kills them, yeah. Yes, exactly. Four hours. There we go. We've got the difficult one, it seems. Yeah, yeah. It actually lowered the bleeding by 130%. Yeah. Well done, Kag. Well done, Teroy. It looks like he's wonking paired off. Teroy and Kag, you may both pat each other on the back three times. <laughs> but only today. three. Yeah, no more, no less. And then resume yeah. wonking, yes? Yes, precisely. But you may pat each other on the back three times. I know I am a benevolent god. <laughs> And you then we hope me, it's true. We hope that they don't gen develop an infection until Izzy gets back. Infection is not really an issue. We got good beds and medical care. But not um, really. May I may I make a serious suggestion, T Wall? Put in some private bathrooms for Pete's sake. You've all got a room for them. Yeah, we're going to. Jeez, how, we're getting how, there. How would you we had to. Yeah, we only got, just we only just got bathroom. Oh, well, we've you got modern the... bathroom fixtures. We're oh, kind of right. waiting for but, that. Well, you could have. Oh, I see. You could have just put latrines in and just upgraded them to toilets. No, we still can't build toilets. But yeah, no, that's not yeah. research queue. So... You mean my research queue? Yeah, <laughs> the research. You're queue. not. You're not the wonk today, Dan. I know. I'm. I keep looking at the research. Like, oh, look, we're going to. But no, I'm, it doesn't. Nothing to do with me. Okay. You're not the wonk. Uh, but you can make basins and bathtubs. So, yeah, yeah you, you, you can just put a latrine in. Like, they're piped in now. The latrine is no longer just a hole in the ground. It's oh, a yeah, hole no. in the ground with a sewage pipe at the bottom. Why are we growing sugarcane tomatoes? Because I wanted to put them in. I'm just doing stuff. I'm just in this is my little investigation garden, okay? Leave me alone. Izzy, did you know that DJ really likes sugarcane? Mm. <laughs> Go and fucking fillet yourself. I you, haven't changed uh, any of the cycloids, so. Streaming, please. <laughs> and? I really think that makes a difference. I was about to say, I've said far worse on her stream than fillet okay. yourself. <laughs> I mean, for God's sake, there's probably a PG one on the stream. Don't worry about it. Well, there is a mature warning on the stream, who, yes. Who was it that uh, was streaming and they had to look up what fillet yourself meant? Oh, and they no. were on webcam while they did it. Oh, and it was no. one of the funniest things I've ever oh, seen no. in my life. Oh, when they, re they realised what it actually was. Yeah, yeah. Yep. No. <laughs> Their faces, they were like, oh no. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> They're not being unseen. Yeah. We got some royal insect jelly, apparently. I'm just gonna, you know, disallow that. Good gourmet oh. meals. Are you visitors? Oh yeah, they're not going to enjoy themselves. Look like they might find them there. I actually like that they are actively six from Oops, well, one died. What, all they've got to do is kill probably the big okay. ones. They might actually do this for us. They might. Who, who are they? They're just Boy. random wanderers. 
Nice. Hey, Mesa. Hey, a free double action revolver. Goes card four. Card four. Well, that that lance that they're shooting at is it? Twenty percent health. Yeah. yeah, they're taking a lot of shots. And then there's just the two uh, pikemen. Down. There we go. The pikemen are easy. Like milkshake deals with the pikemen on his own. Like three, okay. yeah. One uh, left. One la one pikeman left. And then we can just run up and smack the defoliator. They do have quite a range though, the pikemen. Yeah. yeah they do. The the so the secret to killing pikemen is a shield belt and a Thank melee you. fighter. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. Same yeah. with the centipedes. Yeah. yeah. Same with the centipedes. Oh no! He just killed one. Uh, no! Oh, what a shame. Yeah. What More a massive freeze. shame. He's had three meals and a revolver. Yes, please. Join. More free stuff. Don't, How don't we get told off for them dying? No, because no. we haven't caused it. Yeah. And they're wandering through. So I thought I, they, they must have. What are they with? Blue, Blue Mesa. Mesa. Uh. Blue Mesa. Yep, nope, we haven't lost anything Blue Mesa, they're at plus 20. They must so. have altered that from when I originally started playing it, because it used yeah, to be a case of it's your it. map, your problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If they're yeah, traders, if yeah. they're traders then, the it does. then it yeah. does. But if they're just right. wandering through, it doesn't. They did it. They did it. Oh, wow, well, and hang on, Romanian man just so happens to be <laughs> right yeah, here. Yeah, convenient. Beat that up. Going, screw you, angry thing. Screw you. <laughs> Or something similar. Well, Ham, what's Romanian man's background? Shop kid. Housemate. Uh, and housemate. Um. He learnt a little about exotic artifacts. Yeah, I think he knew about technology by the looks yeah. of things. Yeah. And we know Cag knew all about technology. Human computer. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure Cag thinks you lot are fucking insane. That's because we are, right? He does, but he's also acting slightly dumb so they don't cotton on. <laughs> what does that he think sense. about the AI? He's very scared of it and decided, <laughs> decided, decided to go along with whatever it says because he knows he might die if not. <laughs> Hence why he has not and will not go in that room unless directed to. <laughs> See, I think the, 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 so. The, this is like, because the AI definitely gets lonely. I bless him. He, he he's he's all on his own now. Can we? He'd like to request. There's a caravan. Like, ran, caravan ran out of food. Yeah, it's gonna be back in like a very short amount of time. It'll be all right. We made a, 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 a game so they could come down here, but nobody really does. Yeah, could 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 we, maybe, you know those single shelves? Could one of those maybe go into the rec room and, like, maybe move the computer in the rec room and, and like, can, can, can I get moved into the rec room onto the shelf and, like... Um... Yeah, but that, isn't that your car room? Well, I mean, yeah, but... if if you reckon you can be moved, then yeah, we can put you into the rec room easy. But well, we've we piped everything in now, so the network's in. So yeah. I'm about to say, he just asks the wonk that that knows more than he lets on to move you. Well, right. I'm very lonely. No one ever comes down to see me. I actually, put we tried. Things down with people yeah, I I know. No, no one ever comes to see me. I'm lonely, guys. I here I am trying to save your species, and you can't even be asked to come and have a bit of small talk with me. I tell you, I tell you, if what. it weren't for the cameras that I have that monitor your movements twenty four hours a day, seven <laughs> days a week, I wouldn't even know what was going on. <laughs> Not creepy at all. I am fun thing you could do later on: install him inside a pawn. Oh, you can, can't you? Yes, you can. What? How? An operation you can do, once yeah. you know how. Is that from a mod that we don't have? No, that's stock game. Hang on, what? You can install a Persona core in people? Yes. Do what? what? Yeah. What's the point of it, though? I never actually got around to doing it. I didn't even know this was a thing. 
Are you sure this is something you can do? Yes, I am sure it's... Yep. Yeah. Are you but sure it's what, base game? What, what it's base game. What does it do? Uh, I'll tell you, it gives... Uh, consciousness plus 50%. What? <laughs> oh, no, that's... No, that's not... That's, it's a modded one. Um... I'm sure yeah. that there's one in base game that lets you do it. Uh, I, I'm let me, sure, let me I'm check. Pretty, yeah, let I'm. Check. I'm not certain. I'm going to be honest with you, Cag. I have a way of checking this. Yeah. I'm sure I've seen it in base game. Mind you, I run so many fucking mods. How do you even know these days? <laughs> I've seen it as well, but I put, yeah, I might be in kind of degree. It's what it. Yeah, I was about to say. Pretty sure you can't do that because I've done everything in base game and and more. Uh, do you want by any chance use, use expanded prosthetics? Not good engineering. Mm. Yes. Yes, yeah, I do as well. We, um, the mod that adds it. Yep. That's actually one I think I'm gonna add to my uh, current run through. Ran out. Is it oh, one? player compatible? Uh. The easiest way to tell is in the mod menu, when you're loading up a multiplayer file. I can also check it from the its actual folder structure as well. Oh, okay. Oh, so that's like I think they add to the, the folders? Yeah, there's a XML file on there which Lambert! tells it it's compatible. Hey, we just got a raid! Thank you so much, Lambert and guys. Hang I on, think you, Lambert? I think Lambert was playing RimWorld as well. As, as in, in Lord, Lord Lambert. Lambert? Yeah! Yes. Isn't he on this server? Yeah! Well, if he doesn't come and say hello to me, then I will be personally offended. <laughs> so We're there, playing. Lambert. Do you want to? Do you want to explain to Lambert and his guys what, what this whole scenario is? I I'll explain to Lambert if he comes and says hello to me. <laughs> <laughs> me, 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 me. No, in all seriousness, hi Lambert, love you. Um, <laughs> so, hi everyone. Uh, I'm DJ. I'm playing as DM in this game, and this is not a normal game of RimWorld. Um, you need the RimWorld the... role, Lambert, that's why. A, there's a gazillion mods that we have Accurate. running. Accurate, yes. Um, and B, uh, I have gone into dev mode and created them this starter base. This beautiful base. Um, and it's all attached to a story where essentially they're a bunch of filthy primitive tribals that are. are being educated by a slightly batshit insane AI. Teroy is wearing my robe! <laughs> wow, Teroy! Teroy <laughs> Troy know what's up, doesn't he? Yeah, right? I don't think they've even can unpack the caravan yet. <laughs> we'll pass, I'll have that, and that, and I'll walk off now. Thank you. But, uh, I if Lambert is also table. playing RimWorld at the moment, he, he, yes. we should get his opinion on the uh, the the idea of our techno tribals. Yes. Yes. Um. Also, I have an idea for another uh, thing for the techno tribals. Oh. Um. So you know that Odin thing. I've been thinking about it. Uh, like, what else can we do that's a bit like that? That's fun. What if we have a suit of armor that does that? Does what? What zaps things? N no, so that when Hello. you get hit, lightning strikes happen where you are, but make the suit impervious to whatever the damage the lightning does. You want so, to create that will make an amazing melee bomb. Right? So and it'd be so much. And as well, it would be. A, can you imagine if one of them turned up to raid you? Because one be of the things immune, we're doing with this is we're completely immune to fire damage and heat as well. Yeah. Bring that. What we're trying to do is we're trying to design a faction that's going to be great fun to play as, but also fun to have in your game raiding yeah. you and such like. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, um, makes sense. I love you too, buddy. <clears throat> oh, it's Lambert! <laughs> I'm good, thanks. Good. I, I, I also have a, a crap ton of mods in my RimWorld. It's like 280 or something. Oh, you're and... at more mods than we are then. I'm trying to turn RimWorld into D&D. That's basically what we're doing. <laughs> yeah, right. magic, magic mods are fun, but open uh, yeah. world is so complicated. 
Yeah, the the I'm no pretty sure it's also so not balanced. Uh, okay. um, I just got two polar bears. I know I'm yeah. working out where to put them. <laughs> chop chop. I just I just oh my guy is hurt. He's lost an ear. Uh, and then my paladin's like, no, you haven't. Yeah. <laughs> um, I I'm afraid Izzy, you're gonna lose me for five minutes. All right. Uh, in in game. Um, because. Uh, hang on, I, I have to show Lambert my current colony. Which means I have to uh, load a completely different mod list. Yeah. Oh, so I'll see you in about 10 minutes for that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> to be fair, I'm probably only running about 80 mods, so it's not. <laughs> mm, I'm running more than that. Yeah, no, no. Again, I've been yeah. trying, don't forget, I have been trying to create a nicely balanced pack that all works together for everyone to use, which has been quite successful. So far, it's um, been pretty good, yeah. I love the medieval kind of mods. I like oh, playing only medieval. We've gone completely the, like, I'm completely the opposite. I like I super futuristic. I can tell, futuristic. look at Izzy's stream. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, to be fair, that's to do with the story. That interestingly is attached to what I'm about to show you. Mm, uh, Graham, I'm showing you an archival's base. Can you do me a favor? Uh, yes. Uh, De Dev mode, finish all, all your research tree and tell me what you think about the belt. Oh, okay. Um, you look on the fab bench. When, I'll do no, the... uh, yeah, I won't worry about that now. I'll do that later. But yes, so you we can to together. control one colonist. Like your own dude. No, uh, you what? can do everything. No, you. everyone essentially just has a cursor. Okay. Um, we've got a wonderful multiplayer file going at the moment on SFS, where we are um, all controlling one pawn and all building our own houses. She does, doesn't she? Oh, that's so cool. Um, should we make um, this extra person? Do you, should we make them Lambert, considering, you know, yes. he's given us a... Lambert should join in. Yeah, I was thinking that as well, but obviously I was aware that you probably had things to do, which is why you weren't going. But if, if he's free, he should totally join. Agreed. Uh, I'm not free right now, but that's what I figured. I when, when you generally we do it this out. time Thursdays. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Um. I mean, instead of streaming my own room world, I'll just stream yours instead. I'm totally yeah, but okay. But it will with be that. hours, in fact. Uh, hours then. Yes. Yeah. So check this noise out. Uh. Do. Uh. Do want to save this yak? Yes. Pack ammo. I'm He's eating our crops. Yeah, I'm gonna pick him up. Oh. What do we do now? Do we tame him? I guess. Oh, what do you animals actually eat? Because they just eat psychoid. Oh. Yeah, they will do that. Huh. Sorry, uh. this, this this file takes a little while to load. <laughs> Graham, mine crashes every other load. <laughs> yeah, again, I I, I've problems. managed to create a, f a very stable mod pack. Lambert, do you want to know about your pawn? Yeah, ask me about. Tell me about me. So you need a little bit of upgrading because you're frail and you have a bad back. Bad back but... is accurate though. <laughs> and a stab, a stab but your head. look at this. You're a psychopath gourmand. Incapable of social, which is a bit let down. But look how many flames you fucking have. Holy That's a lot shite. of fire. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there was a reason when I saw that that colonist in the trade screen, I was like, yup. <laughs> he also, as far as the tribal people are concerned, has a magic belt. Yes. Hey, Lambert. Yeah, it should be on Lambert. It should be no, it's on not on Lambert, Lambert right now. Yeah, it's, it's not. No, it's. It is. is it? Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, he needs... Milkshake it's needs terrible. to have it. Hi, this, this is my current base. Is that the one that you've played 180 hours in the past two weeks? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's down to only 180 now, is it? It's up for like 250 or what? Not long ago. I can't tell why they've got the game on, which is most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> well, how long have you been playing? You just press shift tab. Tells you at the top. Uh, or just... Not accurate because GJ is involved in two different games. Yeah. But no, this one, seven days, this file, seven days, five hours. Jeez. Yeah, no, th this file is, is silly far along. Um, these floors are jade. Oh, yeah, naturally. Um, <laughs> Obviously. No, no grass in my house. 
Uh, no, there's nothing but fine carpets or sterile floors or fine marble floors. Wait. That's it. Um, and the fine marble floors aren't good enough. So, at the moment, I'm saving up gold. As you do. Because I'm going to replace Listen all to what of it's those, for. <laughs> all of those marble tiles. They need to be gold. So, when you get raided, how, how big is it? <laughs> 86, uh, I think, was the last one, wasn't it? I was about to say, that this is the last raid that I packed. <laughs> Did it die over there? No, it died there. Nothing gets into my base. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've not. I, I got to. I've not seen anything get past the threshold of the kill box. No, <laughs> they, they, they don't get beyond there. It's hilarious. Um, and I have a ring of advanced hydroponics. And then it's it's imagine very very beautiful. The end of the game is to blast off and leave what you've made. Yeah, it's uh, weird, isn't it? Hang on, hang on. Also, it gets better. Yeah, I've so far launched forty-two colonists into space. Holy shit! <laughs> um, I've 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 completed this three times over already. We've already sent three ships off. You should see the size of raids you get whilst you got whilst you have a ship on. Oh, do they get bigger when that happens? Oh yes. And a bit more frequent. Yeah. The first a bit time I played every day. <laughs> the first time I played RimWorld was down in like Alpha Seven, and yeah. I sent off a call. Oh, it was Alpha Six, I think. And uh, I sent off colonists for the first time, or I was going to. Um, uh, but I, for some reason, built it indoors and then the roof collapsed it and and killed the ship and the people in it and i was like you know what what's the fucking point of blasting off i'm staying oh yeah why would you leave this yeah, yeah. all the time you put into it and it's like yeah no game over bye yeah like why why would you leave this place where we have like they're, they're throwing idyllic room. <laughs> like we haven't grown food in three years now um, because we have, like, a freezer full, and we're just eating the lavish meals we have stocked up. They're, 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 they're down to, like, 4,000 lavish meals now. Oh. You know yeah. what you do, Graham? You launch the, in the entire base into space and play Save Our Ship 2. I, yeah, right. Oh! But, but oh, yeah, no, 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 you, you, ship. you start yeah. a new colony on the same map, um, and you have to infiltrate your base and not get murdered by your own traps. Uh, I so would not want to try to solve this <laughs> I, I'm What, in what you're saying is, you want to play Prison Architect but the other way around, which there is actually a you game You actually can do that, yeah. escape mode. It's a lot of fun, to be honest. It is. Mm -hmm. The problem is, the moment you turn up in this map, there are 12 artillery pieces that start shelling you. Mm. And uh, I need to actually get round to replacing those with auto mortars so that my colonists don't. Well, the thing is, it, since you are a player, you are going more smartly about it, and you will not go through the front entrance, but you will take a hole through the wall. No, no, sorry. The problem with that is that every bit of the outside of the base is covered by turrets. <laughs> oh, okay. It's still better there than going a, in the front, though. There it's is not. Well, no, it's turrets and then a row of embrasure walls. Yes, your embrasures, of course. So <laughs> if they dig through the wall, there's just people waiting on the other side of the embrasure. It's really not a problem. Um, do you know, apparently, Graham, I was watching... It's a uh... better option than going through the kill box. <laughs> just. I'm just going to call you Rogel from now on, if that's okay. <laughs> we will fortify this position. <laughs> you, you very much have done. Uh, and, and, and then one last thing, and then I will stop showing you this and get back to playing. Um, nice. <laughs> see all of these. Everyone. See see all of these dark patches. Yeah. They well no, this is from Mechanoids expanded. So you get Mechanoid ships land on your map, and because I'm on an island, they're all very very close. Uh, Salt and, oh, uh, like all of these. Dark patches here are where 
Yeah, let's have a bit of fun quickly. You can leave the game running, guys. It's not going to do anything for a bit. Yeah, but we need to see where we're oh, at at least. Missile launcher. Gotcha. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, Izzy, it's not going to happen for like a day or two yet. It's not going to have a massive effect straight away. The short end of it is we need heating. Yeah, yeah, I was more thinking about what do we need to save crop-wise before they all start dying. Um, We've got plenty... Is that the all spice? Because Harvest... that's almost done. And ha No, harvest any food that's ready. And yeah. anything else we critically need. So, like, if we need claws, harvest. get the cotton. We've got a lot of... Um... Uh, no, 1800 is not a lot. Okay. okay Trust okay. me. Okay, 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 okay. You see that patch of desert over there, Private? Yes. I don't want to. Understood. <laughs> <laughs> Dear me. Um, we do, however, need heating indoors because it's getting yep. very cold inside. Yeah, we have heating. We just need to put the actual heating down. Uh, very very super good. cool. Not gonna lie, super proud of this base. Also, hate it intensely. <laughs> mm-hmm. That figures. Uh, oh, there so, is so much. There is so much I want to change. My bedroom right, so is actually not heat temperature it? because I built a fireplace for the aesthetics. That's the kind of base that gets like... That's right enough. A hundred of oats. A hundred thousand of oats on Reddit or something, you know? Okay, uh, so I've now got a radiator in this room. Does that yep. work? Uh, yes, if, it's it? attached, yep. if it is attached to the hot water network, then yes, yes it will work. Yes. Also, yeah, sure, I will love you and leave you. I've got to go. Yes. See you soon, Lambert. Be amazing. Bye. Bye -bye. Yeah, but does it, it now so... mean, do I have to do anything to make it a different... No, no. No. So I've already set up the hot water supply, so... Oh, yes, sweet. and there's a thermostat which is set to 21 degrees, so it will be making your room the perfect temperature. Although it is my room that's been kept to the perfect temperature, but you know, and all that. You Whatever do not room need radiators in. in the bathrooms. Yeah, but it's the bits connected to it. But, uh, I was about to say the bathroom. Yeah, I've and only the put one in one the room. bathroom. I've only yeah. put one in yeah. the bathroom yeah. for both. Yeah, 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 yeah. So if it's in the bathroom, it will also heat the bedroom. Yeah. Oh no, I get why he's doing it. It's because there isn't pipes that. Yeah, yeah, yep. yeah. Li it's literally because I started it on one side and it wouldn't work there, so I moved the tool to the other side. And I don't have to spin it around that way. It's literal okay. laziness. <laughs> I'm there for that completely. I do that <laughs> so often. Like, there'll be things where it's like, why are they all facing upwards? Well, because that's the way that it's default when you select it. And <laughs> the keyboard was all the way over there. Well, you know what I, you know what I do? I get even lazier. I just create a blueprint in the room once I've done one. Yeah, agreed. Are you using the blueprint mod, did you? See, I don't do that because I like to make every room individually. Mm. Yeah. You're, yeah, you, you know how I like to like individually yeah. detail every single room and make it yeah. uh, mm -hmm. like it reflects the characters that work or live in there and that sort of shit. Because I'm a complete fucking nerd and a loser. Oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not creative for that. What was that? Sorry, Tiro. I'm not creative for that. Uh, to be honest, I'm not. Like, I, I look at a lot of the stuff that I see other people do, and I'm just blown away by it, and I could never do it. But I try to push myself to make things more interesting every time I build them. Okay. Right. Okay, are we ready to go? Yep. Uh, no, I'm joining. Okay. Sorry. Did we make uh, a save? Oh, we didn't make a save. Uh, Izzy, mm -hmm. this is going to take forever. Can you please do a save and I'll rejoin? Yes. Let me know when your save is done, my dear. It is done. Awesome source, I am joining. Joining am I. Downloading. Loading. I've also just fixed the problem where people get tattered apparel. They'll now automatically automatically take it off if it falls below fifty three percent. Cool. I've always the default option. Like What's if that? You, um, if like the default game was set to default to 
like 53% or whatever. Oh, as the wouldn't minimum. it be amazing? But then your problem is, you people that never played the game are like, why am I calling this native? <laughs> oh, oh, maybe like a small check for like when you don't have anything else to put on. But like once. Yeah. I don't know, like they say. But like that would be something that would be so much more convenient. I yeah. am here. Sweet. Oh, what a shame. We are good to go. And really, Dan? Though. Yes. Also, I love the amount of art. Who's made it all? Me. It's all you. It isn't it's all, the. It's, uh, it's, it's all me. It yeah. Around the robot. No, yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. slowly sticking it down across our room to make it really nice and beautiful. Yeah, I'm really liking it, man. I I really really like no sarcasm whatsoever. I'm really liking this. Well done. I like the fact yeah. he's even bothering to put a heater down in the poor little persona room. Oh yeah, I've even wasted some time on the. Yeah, you know, you've got to like keep the persona cold warm. It might freeze or something. I don't know. He's gonna I be moving up with us. I, I thought we were gonna move. Yeah, he's moving yeah, up yeah. with us eventually when we can get a table. Yeah, but like. Well, can't... no, just move one of the one by one shelves. No, they're That's they're being used, for. dude. No, they're not. Like, like no, they can't are. hold enough to be used. They can hold one thing. They they hold a literal single item. They're a complete yeah. waste. Like they don't even hold a stack. It is an item. Yeah. Although they are super useful for keeping components and uranium in in your nuclear power plants. True story, yo. You know what I discovered skips are fucking fantastic. Yes. In yeah. what sense? They store so much fucking steel. How much okay, steel can you get? For some ship? reason, I thought you were talking about the crisp. Oh, okay. like, 900 you, you... in two tiles. Yeah, you get more than you get in the double shelves. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the, the most, if you want the most um, efficient solution, the most efficient solution is the deep storage lockers. Plus, that store 750 steel on one spot. Yeah. Ten stacks, one spot. Meaning in two stacks you get uh fifteen. Fifteen hundred. Yeah. Oh, so I'll do a little improvement to the SRAF and give you uh, mini um mini police boxes that hold an infinite amount. No, do you know what would be super interesting though? What? If you could design like and and this is one to go onto your list for the long term. A version of the SRAF that has a mining bot and a hauling bot built into it. So that when it lands, you can turn on a mining bot and hauling bot and it will mine and haul the site that you've land at, landed at. Well, but obviously to... you'd have to set it to mine and everything, you, you know. I would have to look into doing that because that's an interesting one. Isn't the, like, and if we could do that, obviously that opens up that idea to like so many specialized little ships that you could fly out, right? And like these would be cheap, nasty, dirty things, right? Like I, in my head, you know, in Red Dwarf, the the um the little ship, the yellow one that they always fly around in. Yeah, yeah. That kind of thing, yeah. I was thinking um, make, make a use for the silly one that breaks down. Yes, but to be honest, I just want it to look cooler than that. The the one that breaks down all the time just looks so shit. It, it... That's the point of it, it's made cheap and shit. Yeah, yeah, no, I know, but it, if we're gonna do it, it could look a bit cooler. I make it like a room, uh, room world style dragon. The... I'm joking, but that would probably look yeah. quite cool. No, I've been trying to work out other things that we can do for the uh, the tribals, like, um, what other stuff can we give them to make them unique? You know. Um, um I was thinking about that actually. Specialized walls. Yeah. Like they don't do anything, but they just—it's something that only they can build. Like roomed walls or something daft like that. Oh, like no, no, no. Go on. Okay, so they build special walls. Um, the 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 that they like they they research and they build special walls. That's the only way they can build power. Their walls have power lines built into them. 
and generate a little bit. I could get behind that, that their walls <laughs> passively generate a tiny little bit of power. While well, transmitting it, yeah. It would have to be very small, though. Oh, I'm thinking, like, 10 watts max. Probably a watt. But no, you think about how many how many walls you build, right? Mind you, they won't need that much power, will they? It depends on what we give them. Like, this yeah. is the other thing. Like, I don't... Like, in my head, these techno tribals, they're not living in, like, tents with, with fucking fire pits, are they? They're no. living in techno tents with techno fire pits. Ah <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, the big difference there. So what we're basically making is is uh, cyberpunk w w without it being 2077. It's cyberpunk tribal edition. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, pretty much. You really do need to play that game. I will do it at some point, don't yeah, I? I know. Um, but yeah, we that would be um, quite good fun. Um, I do really like this idea of them being like, uh, like their research being a bit different, and you know them essentially having a different research tree. Obviously, some of it will double over, but them having unique parts of the research tree, I really like that idea. Well, one of the mods I run, the Warhammerish Dryads. Yeah. requires a dryad spot to actually research. Yeah. So what you can do is you can lock the tribal one behind um, the tribal start. Yeah. Exactly. And so it's like, you know, you can't play as a spacer faction and do this. This is... But then al alongside that, it's not a normal tribal start, is it? It's going to no. be very different. Well, what I was actually considering, you know the um, medieval storyteller from Expanded? Yeah. That disables everything? Yeah. You build off of that, but make it so you can only do the tribal stuff? Yes and no. I still want like them to be able to get to the late game techs and that sort of thing. But, but no, you see what you, do is you, you design there. your you design your way there. Yeah, exactly. Where appropriate, like, they have their own versions of it. Like with batteries, they should have crystals. Mm. That's an easy one, right? Yeah, just it's straight, it's yeah, straight, yeah, yeah, yeah. Straight battery config with a yep. different model. Yeah. Combat supplier. Oh. Ooh, to nice. be honest, a lot of it, Graham, is literally me doing that, that speeding yeah, config. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I was having a chat with someone actually in Dub's um, Discord earlier. Yeah about um basically some of his when when stuff's being used they light up yeah i was asking how that works um what we came up with or what was suggested and i actually thought of it before they said it was when it so it's going to have two different texture states so it's actually invisible when it's built yeah but as soon as it's built it goes into the inactive state yeah which then draw it then automatically draws the inactive state texture, but when it gets used, it flicks over. Yeah, got you. So from your perspective, you won't see a difference, like, m once you built it, but when you build it, it's invisible. Yeah. That's the one downside. So, yeah. Yeah, we can, we can definitely um, play with this. Yeah, that's what someone came up with. You would have to have a, like, a like very bare texture and everything else just gets drawn when it's not being used and being used. Yeah. Wait, oh, Troy, where are you just in your bedroom drafted? Just drafted, he was yeah. Because of what? He, he was, was freezing. Oh. He's getting rid of his hypothermia. Um, pawns automatically do that. Yeah, but... Sometimes it's nice to micro. Uh, also, don't forget to send Sally out to trade with this combat supplier as quickly as possible. You don't want them dilly-dallying because they'll fuck off because of the temperature. Okay, he's just doing a um, recruit at the moment. Our traders aren't quite here yet. 
Good God, minus 23 degrees centigrade. Oh, that is a cold snap. Yeah. Are they? Alright, he's going out yeah, after he's out now. He's going immediately after he's done this. Cool. Sally expressed, expressed interest in Senra's sexual yep. experience. Yep, don't question it. Senra offered him, uh, 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 Sal Sally offered Senra a chance to change teams. Yeah. Uh, fun fact, they're both female. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Sally was just hitting on Senra, though. Is Sally gay? Neither are gay. No. no. <clears throat> well, they have some medicine. Well, here's a question, Graham. Mm -hmm. How would you do their own version of heating? If not using fires. Hmm. They should have uh, uh, uh they should have fires, but they should be like uh, no fires. There's another garden oh, bot. Yeah. Oh, we want we that. We need it. And a crypto rifle as well. Oh, we want that. I don't and think we And a crypto can heavy them. armor. Lord. Uh, we That's might fine. have to send sell our advanced components then, and other things. What could we sell? Double barrel shotgun. Let's sell all the weapons. Yeah. Charge rifle, not. Not the charge rifle, yeah. Although, no, oh, they have a good one. Never mind. Oh, we no might have to sell some gold. Armor. Oh, how much is the gold worth? No way. Do we need the stone, st uh, stone skin gland? That's worth grand and a half. We were going to, yeah, we bought it. Yeah, at this point, I'm s tempted to say, fuck it, sell all of them and get that crypto armor. What? We can't. Oh, no, you've already put it in. Uh, No, I don't think we've got enough even with that. No, we, we get the crypto rifle, we've not got the rifle and the armor. Yeah, mm. I, I was going the armor. We just want to make. Hang on. Armor. Well, no. Yeah, no. Look, there you go. Done. Oh, hand. Did you get rid of the armor? Yeah. Yeah. Put the armor back in. Do we really need the garden bot? Like... Yeah. Yes. Yeah. There you go. Fifty yeah. components done. Oof. Still leaves us with fifty-four components. We're not. We sure are selling all of those things we just bought, though. The circadian stuff. Yeah, that's acceptable. It's worth it, though. Is it really for the armor? For, no, for what you're getting, it's very acceptable. Yeah, it's got pretty good ratings. Yeah, like that uh, garden. I would even more. say sell the other cooking skill trainer because we really don't need it. Because we're buying a gardening bot which can cook. Yeah. And we're getting a crypto rifle, and the crypto armor is better than the stone skin gland for milkshake. Yeah. Though obviously it will degrade eventually. We've got a mending bench. Okay. Once it gets mended, <laughs> ironically. Yeah. So I accept okay. that. Okay. It hurts, but okay. Get milkshake in that armor. Then there you go. They're leaving straight away because of the dangerous temperature. Because, yeah. Or you give the weapon to Troy as well, then. He's got the highest shooting, I believe. Yeah. Is the weapon worth hunting, though? No, but... not particularly. Micromanage yourself with that, Tiro. You'll want that when you're wandering around, and any time you go hunting, swap to the bolt action rifle. But the. So basically, the was a secondary. The crypto rifle is, is your best, like. Like, it's a great rifle to have when you're just meandering about, because it's, um... Uh, like, very fast to fire. Also, have you got anyone set to construction, guys? Yeah, me. I don't... 
because uh, I would recommend that you prioritize a couple of people to because you got a lot yeah. of repairs out here to do that you yeah, just yeah, haven't yeah. gotten done. And you don't. I was looking to do it earlier. Rules. Yeah, Milkshake has his armor. Yeah, I told him to go. Uh, right. Who's got the shield belt? Lambert. Uh, Who? Lambert still. Uh, Lambert should not have the shield belt because Lambert can shoot. Yeah, I think he just picked it up whilst you were traveling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Get Milkshake wearing that shield belt because then Milkshake's in a shield belt, crypto armor. Um, uh, has a Zeus hammer. Milkshake is going to be a fucking monster. FYI, FYI, everybody, I just turned the uh, electric boiler up to full because it had woefully inefficient amount of heating. Oh, right. Fair yeah, enough. okay, so guys, the way that this works, if you click on the electric boiler, is it? Yeah. Uh, you will see connected demand slash capacity. Yeah. 1800 of 2000 units. So this boiler is now producing 2000 units of heating. You're yeah. using 1800 of it. Yeah. There, it can you see the pack. increase and reduce power dials in the, the buttons? Yes. Yeah? Right. Those are how you control that. If you reduce power. Like, just do it quickly. Quick reduce power. There yeah. you go. It's now producing 1,750, but using less power, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so the more power you pump to it, and the AC will work the same when you have air condition. Yeah, that's fine. So is all the base now nicely lit heated, is it? Uh, um, most except of it. three, four bedrooms, yes. And then three bedrooms. Done. Nice. You'll also probably want to get air conditioning in. Yeah, yeah. When you learn how to make it. It's a lot easier to make. Uh, so the bathroom is not heated, just FYI. It's minus 10 in there. Uh, that one in there. You should yeah, probably chuck a little radiator in there. Yeah. Because they like their little bathtub in there, don't they? they also, do, don't yeah. forget, when you do start to build... Right, so, see where Izzy's room has the bathtub, Izzy? Oh, you've yeah. done it. It's been done already. Do you know how to do this? I don't um, know. So, okay, so if you click on the bathtub... Yeah. Can you see there's a button that says link bed? Oh, yeah, I did that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You did that, so you know how that yeah. works. Cool. Yeah. Awesome source was just making certain. Mm-hmm. I love how Tiroi has properly decorated his room. Why is Lambert sleeping on the floor? Because we need to get him a, uh, a bedroom. We're lo it, woefully lacking bedrooms right now. Because it's time to Tiroi. Well, does he not well, have a room? No, he doesn't. No. no. We're working on it. Yeah, we'll, okay. can, we can work it from Sally as well. It should be fine, I guess. Would you like the wonk to mine for a bit, then? No, I'm or making milkshake mine. Milkshake is is high mine. Don't worry. Yeah, but milkshake is out mining over here rather than doing the mining inside the base. Yeah, that too. I. Where is all I don't. Pieces, uh... I don't. I've no idea what's going on out here. Someone else has decided to do it. And yeah, I, I would cancel all of that for the time being and get milkshake working on digging out the new bedrooms. God, 
Uh, I wanted that there anyway. Well, also, why the are you not putting toilet. toilets in your? I was wondering about. Because we don't. Because we don't have toilets yet. Like trains. Working on it. Yeah, you can put a latrine in. Yeah, yeah like, if I wanted to. Check getting their extra tiers. So you might, yeah. Why not, not waste it? We're all just waiting. I I. Whereas, my wonk likes taking a private dump in the morning. That's fine. Yeah. He can like what he wants. Yeah. I have to share the, to the toilet at the same moment. No, Keg's got his own toilet. Yep. yep. It's insensible, he's built a plastic latrine. You said it had what to look waste? good. Nope, nope, the AI said it had to look good. Yep. You mean putting a latrine now? That's, that's a waste. No, it isn't. Well, that it's plasteel. functionally the same as a fucking toilet at <laughs> No, this I said building it now rather than building it Yeah, now. no, it's functionally the same as a toilet. I built it for a very long time ago. Even worse? Yeah. Built really fact, I built it before you lot done your bedrooms. It, and as said, it's functionally yeah. identical yeah. to a toilet. And not only that, in the morning when they get out of bed, they walk all the way up to the toilet, go to the toilet, have a wash, then get a meal. Yeah. Wastes oodles of time. And given given that uh, my wonk is slow. Okay, yeah. guys, help. Yes. Uh, yeah. It now yeah. does not have enough demand capacity. Do we need to build another a boiler? Yep. We do. Yep. I knew it was going to do that. Next to it? Like yep. there? Yeah. As long as it's attached to the network, it doesn't matter where now, it is. Now, additionally, what you can do if you're having power problems is build the solar one outside. Mm, I did notice there was a solar one. Yeah, but as long as it's connected into the as long as it's connected yet. into the pipe network, it will work. Or you can build uh, a little boiler. Okay. That too. But we don't have trees planted, so I mean, yeah, yeah. shit, of trees outside, but. But there you go, another boiler. So turn it up so that it gives you the capacity you need. It's actually more efficient to tune both of them. At the same time. Why? The cost got per unit of energy is exactly the same. It's, it's 100 watts per unit of energy. Uh, 100 watts per 100 units of heating. It makes no I, difference. I think it might be the, the air con I'm thinking of then, because it gets more... I'm pretty no, sure it gets more... No, 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 Thank you so much for the too... follow. Is it? Oh, okay. welcome. Sorry, I'm sure is at it... one point... Hang on, hang on. Go on. Uh, that was it. It's fine. Oh. Uh, yeah, no, the, the aircon is uh, double the cost per cooling unit. So it's 200 watts for 100 cooling units, not two, uh, not 200 for 200. That's it wasn't that. I was uh, under the assumption for a while that it was more expensive to turn them up than it was to build, an to build another new one. Ones. Yeah, no. So, no, no, no. So do they have like a maximum power or output yes. thing? If you yeah, see where it's But got once power they're mode, attached so. together, then you're kind of operating both? Almost? Yes. No. No, like one is at eight of eight, and the other one will be at whatever you set it at. Okay, yeah, but, but they are both their operating. demand capacity is the one that Share. is shared. Yes, Share. yeah, it's yes. your entire network. <laughs> yes, yeah, the, the that's demand cool. and capacity is on the entire network, so you can just right. add more and more and more of them. And yeah, turn, um, turn them up as needed. And turn them up as needed. Like you know, okay. my big base. Yeah. I've got something like fifteen air conditioning units at full mm -hmm. power and eight heating units at full power. Well, that doesn't yeah. sound like a good thing. Right, uh, where is he? Y'all been hunting for food. Yeah, he is. <laughs> and fur. Run, run away. I vote we rename Izzy to food. No. All those in favour say aye. Aye. No. The AI all those, has all those uh, against say nay. Um, I am definitely against. You can't do this to me. But you didn't say nay, so I can't actually register yeah, your no, vote, I'm afraid. What was that, sorry? Am I allowed to send in the animals to save Izzy? I don't Who's see why not. the animals? Just make me walk away. You're kind of, you're already to be honest, I, I don't actually know why you stopped. You should have just kept running. Because I had a big rifle! I thought I was going to kill it! Might be it. Actually, no, your shooting is quite high. Yeah. yeah. As long as I get away she's from got it. Its, it. She's got its movement down. Here you go. Get away. I'm trying. You'll need to run further than that. Keep running. I'm working, I'm working, Mark I'm working further. on it. 
much further. Ow. Just send the polar bears in. They are. I meant not I like not the not the other thing else, just the polar yeah. bears. <laughs> no, no, you just get everything to maul the shit out of it. Okay, you have to stand still, otherwise I cannot do these. Yeah, is he just moved to there? Sorry, right. unpause. Move really far okay. away. Keep running. Stand still. <laughs> yeah, no, because the animals got here. You need to stay still, or he can't do what he's trying to do. Where are they going? Uh, up. Yeah, I was wondering that. Don't shoot me. Here you go. There you go. Dealt with it. It's now getting mauled by multiple polar bears. Whoever bears can eat it. it. Yeah, that's fine. Yep. They can eat it. Go, nom 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 nom. Nom nom. Good noms. Death in 18 hours. Did you just nearly get oh. mauled to death? By uh, no, no, the, uh... that's that's the polar bear. Oh. That's only a polar bear. I think we should keep it. Quite a bite. Yeah. I mean, it's one, so it'll be harder, but still. I like how the prisoner is uh, unconscious on the floor. Yeah, I just turned <laughs> that off. Of... So oh, what right, I'm gonna yeah. do is I'm gonna turn that off of being a prisoner bed, and then if we just reinstall that in there, then mate, he's got a tiny little bedroom for himself. Fair enough. Where, where did you do it? Just in the room that's got the <laughs> toilet in. Apparently I'm just using it. Yep. It's a public toilet. It won't be when the bed goes in there and then I link the toilet to yeah. the bed. There you go. No longer a public toilet. And set owner Lambert. There you go. Lambert has a bedroom. I think this gardening bot is bugged out. Why? Uh, I can only deactivate it. Where no, it? it's sleeping. If I do activate all from another station, uh, oh. it's sleeping. It's charging. No, well, one of the gardening, one of the gardening bots is cooking. Yeah, and it may also be that there's no jobs for it to do. Yeah. Minus one outside. It's activated. Yeah, no, there's nothing for it to do. Yeah. It can't grow anything because it's too cold. And Roy, you're standing outside. Troy, yeah, is there a reason you're standing outside, Troy? Drafted. <laughs> Again. What is Romanian man doing? Uh, There's an archery um, target. Okay. It's hidden by all the crosses. In, in, the, in the freezing cold. Yeah, it's only a little bit cold. Um, somebody should probably move the prisoner. Nah, don't worry about it. He'll Spine be fine. He's sleeping. No, no, the one that isn't sleeping. Who's the warden? Me, uh, I think. That's why nothing's happening. Oh, no, Sally oh. is. He's sleeping. What other pris prisoner? <sighs> the other one that's down. Warden, no, there's two. But the, the one that Sally is now grabbing. The one that Sally is now moving. Oh, right, there he is. How cold is it in those prison cells? Not that cold. I'm not that cold. Twelve. It's getting um, heat from uh, both rooms either side. Yeah. Well, uh, actually, no. One. From one, just, well, two, yeah. three, th four sides. Five, yep, four sides. That bottom. No, the, the one below are freezers, so they're at minus nine, so it is not getting heat from there. Oh, right, I thought you were about the ones that were prison cells. That oh, no. Can we change the uh, ground zones indoors for double strength? I yeah. would think that would be very sensible. Because double strength dusters are amazing. Devil Strand, everything is amazing. Yep. Lies. What was that, sorry, is it? Lies! What are lies? Everything. Everything is lies. See the case everything. I got for on earlier. Sorry, the skin. Yeah. What, what, lovely, what, uh... what lovely packaging. 
What a lie story is he? Everything is lies. Everything is lies. Yep. Are you sure about that? Uh, pretty sure, yeah. Guys, 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 guess what? What? I'm hanging out in the in the the. the, the <laughs> I set room. that up. I'm glad it glad it finally oh, worked. Oh yeah, finally. <laughs> I finally it's set up and it I'm finally here. worked. I can talk to you guys while you're, you're chilling out. And, you did and... already do that though. Well, yeah, but now I can actually do it in person. Does it yeah. count you know, as in person like when face, you're not a person? Like when you have no contact. What, are, like you, fact, are you saying that I'm less than a person? No, I'm wondering if you I, count I, yourself I, as a person because well, she yeah, clearly. Really. I mean, what else would I count myself as? I'm, I'm, I'm a I person. Don't I, I don't know spirit. because do do, do god Depends beings count as people? Gone. I'm not crazy. You're crazy. It's like a crazy person would say. <laughs> Look, I'm not crazy. Uh, um. I, I, do you know who is crazy though? In all seriousness, your crazy? mate. But, but but don't tell him that I said so. Uh, Oathbender, he, yeah. he's crazy. Your mate, he's pretty crazy. Yeah, he's he's a bit doolally, gonna be honest. Being sealed inside that room for a thousand <laughs> years just didn't do him any good. I tried to keep him sane, but oh, is that the Zeus hammer? Yeah, yeah. He, he he went a bit doolally in the end, like. Is anyone is else sick of this rain and thunder, by the way? I'm actually ignoring it by this point. It's probably because I was... No, it's best. not. No, it's, no, it's, not. it's still time. there. We've still got Quest time left. Hasn't finished yet. Yeah. 15 days, I think, for it. <sighs> oh, Graham. So this is what happens when you walk in the room. All the tribal people think uh, they're well, talking. The to... anymore. What was that, Terry? And, and Keg was talking, but what did you say, Terry? The quest is not active anymore. Yes, no, it, it is. is. Don't worry, it's fine. The only active quest I see... No, uh, uh, Terroi, look in historical <laughs> quest. It's still it's because of that. Look, it's, look, it's look, at the forced, quest, so. look at the forced weather. Hang on. Yeah, look at the forced... Yep, yeah, Jesus, Terroi. <laughs> I think it said something like 18 set. days. A forced weather for Coca. 14 days ago. How long in that message does it tell you that it will be forced weather for? Four days. How many days? 18 days. Yeah, I, I thought it was 18. Yeah, That's a pretty good memory. Days no, because, no, because, Turo, the moment that you accept it and the weather you get starts, the rewards. you have completed yeah. the quest. So yeah. it isn't active. You get the rewards. I do probably agree it should be shows an active effect so it's still active, but... But it does not! Eight. When was that? Because a day... Uh, a month is 15 days. 15 days, yeah. yeah it should have been done by ages ago. No, because it started on the it's not, it's not been that many. Two quarters ago. It's winter. Oh, sorry. No. Right. Slow, sorry. yeah. Um, it was th it was fourteen days ago. Yeah, sure. Yeah, <laughs> that's okay. Good. Body parts. Oh, as I was saying, um, when <laughs> yes. tribal people walk into the rec room, they think they're talking to a god. Yes. Whereas the people not know better, look look at them very funnily. Look at the persona con go. <sighs> it's yes. fine. I'm I'm sure that the the, the crazy persona core is in no way, shape, or form terrifying. No, no. not to especially the point where the as I'm fairly doing his own thing. especially as I'm fairly sure milkshake at this point is my loyal enforcer. <laughs> I well, will a hundred percent agree with that. Enough. Milkshake yep. will just be some sense in people. Yeah, milkshake will be down well, they with need that. It or not. Milkshake's smart enough to know what's what. <laughs> and, you know. Lambert, why are you... Okay, don't worry. As far Lambert, as you concerned. still have the shield belt! Oh my god, Lambert. Stop it! <laughs> Hang uh, on two seconds, Troy. There's a uh, very easy way to fix this. I know, Let's I'm getting him to do it. Get your shield belt off. Fucking... 
I'm fixing it. Let me fix it. Let me fix it. Fix Go it. Stop fix fixed. it. Fix it. No, I'm doing it. Damn it. <laughs> no, I'm doing it. <laughs> shall, I show you the, shall I show you the easy way of fixing it? What were you I just doing? Got him to I, just, I just got him to drop it. Yeah, no. What? <laughs> You'll pick it up again. No, yep. because I I I um I press space and it. then I told milkshake to go equip it, and then shall it counts the... as reserved. Shall I show you the better way of doing it? Is it? No, In all no. seriousness, if you don't want something, fix them up. No, seriously. Click a sign. What sign? A sign at the bottom. That one. Yeah. Click manage outfits. Oh, I hate this go... thing. Go into anything. Yeah, she knows how to use it. Okay. Yeah, go into right, utility yeah. and just. Untick shield belt. That means nobody with anything will pick it up. Yeah, that's good. I, I don't like the manage outfits. It's, it's amazing. It's great. It's just a bit yeah. pernickety. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's just you awkward. Just, just have to get used to using it. Yeah. All right. What do we so like yeah, outside? Milkshake knows knows like that his bread is buttered. Ever since he arrived here, he got given an oath bender. Yeah. Who you know. It was a bit weird at first, but I think Milkshake's all right with it now. I think he'd, he's got used to it. I think he'd be confused if the wailing stopped at this point. You know what it is? It'd go crazy if the sound stopped. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He wouldn't know what to do if, if it stopped. It's like, like... I've got um, a server in my room that's constant running. It's not loud fans, but whenever I turn it off, my ears start ringing because I'm like, there's something completely very wrong in here. Yeah. But I just don't hear that low hum anymore. Yeah. Oh, milkshake! You got so close to digging out the bedrooms. And I know, I know. We just decided back to, to stop. digging out up here. <laughs> Which he's doing? Why? I uh, because. I think Dan's trying to make all the fields square. Yeah. Yep. It's annoying me. There's bigger priorities than making a fucking field square. No, there aren't. It's the most important priority. I'm sorry, <laughs> someone's mental state is more important than something being square. I what if know, the square I, I, impacts the mental state? <laughs> I, I, I was about to say, it. I, 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 I'm not certain about this. Like, are you trying to argue that aesthetics aren't important? Because um, I'm not saying not important. That goes against saying, everything DJ I'm saying knows. That potentially a, low, a, a psychic drone that is going to affect someone that's already affected by a moodlet he shouldn't have in the first place. Is a bad thing. We're not getting a psychic drone. It might happen. But we're not getting one to find out. I plan ahead. Yeah, to be fair, Dan, like, you, you getting your field square is less important than getting the new bedroom. Oh, I agree. <laughs> like, lots less important. Why are you I started that when there wasn't any building going on, so I was, the time it wasn't needed. To be fair, it's like... Maybe uh, the Wonka's just had an argument with Milkshake about how, about it. It's like trying to explain how the sky is blue. <laughs> it's just not going to work. To be fair, Milkshake's pretty smart. He's been doing a lot of research. Yes, yeah, but, but he's he been doing a lot of smart. research. Yeah. He's, yeah, look at his intellectual. He's, he's pretty smart. Uh, yeah, but going by his backstory. He's not stupid. I didn't say he was stupid. What do we get for this Fenrir hunt? A cooking skill trainer and an advanced component. I mean, <clears throat> I'm not confident you lot can take out a Fenrir yet. No, we don't really need either of those at the moment anyway. I'm probably well, great. to be honest, the Fenrir skin itself would be more the prize there. Fenrir skin is more valuable than Thrombofer. And also... We yeah, I would I would say no, personally. I like how whoever it is is now is now putting more mining jobs on when there's still bedrooms to make. Where? Where? Outside. Where? Over here. I saw <laughs> someone do it just now. Like where they're doing now, that wasn't there a minute ago. No, it was. That's components. No, uh, where Romania man is, that was not there, and I saw someone put it in. I IT think. Oh. Pause. Uh, so should I quit and you guys save?
It, no, just save and then resync. Just wait until the save is done. Oh no, yeah, quit and then rejoin. You're right, sorry. Ignore me. <laughs> I'm a moron, leave me alone, alright? Save is done. Save is done, rejoin when ready. Ba 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 Do 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 Exactly While I wait I'm gonna sit and write some more configs Do 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 I'm breaking Wicked Go time. Let us make the bedrooms. It will happen. Boom. I'm finding it interesting that none of our um, colonists are deciding to, you know, hook up. None of them like each other. Oh. I mean, Sally did clearly try and hit on the uh the prisoner yes even though she doesn't swing that way herself yes so was she trying to like gaslight her into being gay when there were no gay people in the base maybe i'm not sure um, also there's animals starving yeah it's the polar bears yeah they can only eat meat yeah i know I'm deciding whether I want to keep them or not. I'm probably just going to slaughter them, to be honest. If we kill one of the polar bears and feed the other one, then it has me for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Who's going to uh, wear a great dress? Sally, because he's our social guy. Gives 20% uh, plus 20% social. And he can also get a head for 20%. You make them wear the weirdest things. Smartest things. No, weirdest. Well, Sally is 15 social, so 2 times percent percent is quite amazing. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna stop myself from building sculptures because we don't have much more room for any. Well, they're good for selling. Just switch up to large sculptures. Yeah. Okay. The lady's hat, <gasps> which is he wearing, is also plus 20% social impact. Prison break. This is not going to go well for them because the only way out is through the turrets. Mm. We're just like the yeah, And the animals. Mm -hmm. can, oh you, can you put the animals in one tile, Teroy? Sure. Not like not. the one tile that Don't they have to walk like through. The doorway tile. Yeah, that they're going uh, to have to I can do that, but they probably get one shot. Who? The baddies? People. The yes. people. Oh yeah, that's a good point. They will just die. Hello, Nickers. You can put a few animals there, though. Yeah, do that. How are you, Pants? Good. I'm... I'm drafted, and I'm gonna melee attack one of them. Okay, let's go. Hang on. Lego. Alright, and I've got Troy to do it as well. We'll see what happens. Where is it gets knocked down? But I get up again. 
What did the other guy do? Did he just decide he wanted to get back in again? He just sort of stood there because he's waiting for his mate. Is he got the shit kicked out of that? <laughs> Dan took a shot at the freaking. <laughs> oh. Cut his head off! Cut his head off, man! He's down. Oh. Well, well, I, I think he just broke his head. Terry. Well, it was his head. No, it's definitely his head. I'll check in a second. I just saw his this... neck. Where does his body go? Uh, yep, so yeah, actually, his head is still in text. It's just, it's just somewhere probably in the event. Yeah, yeah. That so upsets it's just on me. On TV. Don't worry, the cleaning bots will take care of it. So yeah, you full on just cut his head off. Yes. That's <laughs> upsetting. Striking fucked up. Uh, I like the fact he was a non-violent of the two of them. He just run up and chop his head off. Um, minor problem. Izzy yeah, can't walk. I know. And our dude is dying. Lemmet is dealing Don't with it. Eat it. Oh my god. I was about to say it could have been Wonk to the rescue. Lambert can do medical wonking. Oh okay. He's he better at medical wonking than me, so yeah. yeah. I'm having Romanian man tend to me because time is not an issue. And he likes to be useful. Oh, you've you've had a toe cut off, is he? Ah. By Barocca uses his left fist and and two just. Enthusiastically and hit Izzy with a smash from the left fist. Especially yeah. our right second two. I'm oh. somewhat annoyed that we lost that person. Sorry. Not a lot that could be done there, really. That was one of them things. Indeed. So, Graham, given a thought to how the art style's gonna look for, like, benches and crap like that. Question. Kind of, yeah. Blue glowy rooms. Blue glowy. Okay, so Wait. crafting table. Blue <coughs> glowy stone. No, blue, glow blue glowy runes. Oh, runes, runes. right. R runes. Of the scape. I was thinking instead of these, instead of them using steel for things, basically just use stone for things and wood. But I'm talking stone blocks, not um, yeah, not bricks. Yeah, but it. No, I'm. I I I think maybe something else. Like they need to refine into their own special bricks. I think. Which they rune then, because like, you know how we were, yeah, these runic bricks. <coughs> okay, what would you make them out of? See, my gut's like, crystal, obviously, but there's no crystal in the game. Okay, what base material? Yeah, no, that's, that's, that's what I'm trying to think of, what works. Jade. Yeah, but you see, jade's, jade's pretty too rare. rare, yeah. yeah. Maybe they just break stone chunks up and you just get small amounts of it. Like, say you got to break up... Break up two and you get one. Hey, DJ. Yeah? Uh, I just got sent, sent an article that... Um, the, have you ever heard of the, the company U Diagnostics? No. Oh, it's... Uh, in the Netherlands, it's the largest corona test uh, supplier. Yeah. And they had a da data leak and uh, the uh, personal information of about 10,000 tested uh, Dutch people are... Uh... Oh, lovely. Yeah. Well, I've desynced. Oh. Oh. Do a pause. We'll save. Yeah. Speaking of which, we've got curfew from Saturday, haven't we? Yeah. Yeah. Probably. Oh, it's... Yeah, 9pm. 
coffee. 9 p.m.? Yeah. Oh, interesting. I'll because be uh, Mark Rutte really wanted to have it earlier. Yeah. Dave is, uh, 9 p.m. Made. seems to be the the sort of agreement they've come to. Yeah, compromise. Well, I question if you're out, out uh, after 9 p.m., what the <coughs> fuck are you doing? Yeah. Probably. Visiting well, to be honest with you, my first immediate question was, um, Will it carry over to like delivery drivers? That was my only concern because we quite often order food after nine o'clock. Uh, there are exceptions. It, yeah, exactly. Say, I would say drivers, no because it's a vital service. Yeah, delivery so, drivers are allowed. Uh, out, so it makes no difference to us at all. Basically, you have to have a worker's permit or something like that. Yeah. Uh, and if you can show that and it is not falsified, uh, you're fine. If it's falsified, it's actually a crime. Oh, I I'm surprised. Oh. What was that, Dan? Sorry, I was simulating. I tried to join our simulating. I'm just rejoining. Cool. I have saved Sorry. it. Yeah, I know. That's why it's weird. Rejoining, that's fine. Oh, the um, do you know how Peen's um, decided on who their racing director is going to be? Yeah, it got announced the other day. The, uh, like, some chap from... Um, like, he's done a bunch of stuff for Renault in other sports, hasn't he? Like, other motorsports. What is interesting is that Lewis still hasn't signed his blessed contract. I'm back. All right. right. Strange boy. But yeah, Up to stuff, my, definitely. My gut, um, for what their stuff should look like, is actually um, a mix between... Like, if you look at the normal plasteel walls, not the the reinforced ones, but the, the yeah. standard. And have you watched plasteel in this game? Like, plasteel walls in this game at all? How do you mean by watched? Like, during, um, like, daylight. The colour of plasteel is very interesting. How do you mean? Um, it changes colour dependent on the light that's on it because it's like I think they all, all the materials do, but because plastic is so light, you see it more. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I'll go with that. And it's really interesting. Um, and and like as as the sun is moving across the sky and you know your light's changing throughout the course of the day, if you sit and watch like a large slab of plastic walls, it changes colour with it and it looks really pretty. And so my gut says that what we should be aiming for, for their material, is it should come out looking like plasteel, inscribed with glowing blue runes. And the glow needs to be really subtle. Like, you know the glow that the advanced batteries give off if they're in a dark room? Mm. That kind of level of glow, yeah. So what you're saying is you want all the walls that literally give off light. A Not tiny, tiny visual. little yeah. bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I like that. Well, the thing is, given that we want the walls to generate a little bit of power, that yep. does does make sense. Yep. And then, um, like, power generation, anything like that, should be crystals. Oh, like storage, definitely. Um, yeah, but also power generation. Like, um... Maybe we could have a thing where um, they have a, a circle of crystals that get hit once every six hours by lightning, guaranteed, no matter what the weather is. Just as a graphical effect. But in reality, what it does is every six hours it dumps a load of energy into your system. And then you have to rely on batteries. That as a tribal, there's no guaranteed way to constantly produce power you have to rely on this once every six hours dump of energy. Your AR could actually get the game to strike it with lightning. Yeah, in that case, even better. How cool would that be? I was actually thinking about along that line of making it uh, sort of random, like between this and this long. So it can't happen within, say, uh, like an hour or two of each other. But after that, it can happen whenever it wants. 
up to uh, make it a minimum of once every six hours because otherwise it'll get annoying yeah but What's and then map? up to 12 hours and then yeah what it should be is that it basically that lightning strike should fill as many fucking batteries as you have on the map yeah well after watching what the um lightning rods do yeah I'm convinced that's the way to go, where it releases energy yeah. over time. That could work, yeah. As long as it's enough to, again, fill, like... I, I You would only want one of these sites, right? And, and you don't want too many lightning strikes happen, because we don't want to impact on performance too much. And if you've got, like, a million of these fucking things, it will impact on performance. Oh, no, so... I was thinking about it being you build one of them and that's all you need. Yeah, exactly that. It, it's essentially, like, a center point of your colony that provides all the power. Yep. Like, it's a monumental amount of power. Like, it's yep. stupid. It should also be... And, and this is something I think should be true of their stuff, in general. Resource-wise, fairly cheap. Yeah. Um, work, you know, there's the work resource. Yeah, it's really high. Have that really high. Yeah. Where there's stuff, it, or not, and, and by resource wise, really cheap. I don't mean the amount, I mean the type of resources. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's just gonna be crystals. Like, straight up, just gonna be crystals. What, they're resources? Where will they get them? Now, I thought about this a couple of ways. You yeah. either build something where. It's basically like a pit they dig, where they'll just get, while they're working it, they'll just get crystals. Because they're just digging out of the ground, mashing up stones, no, whatever grow you want to call crystals. it. No, grow the crystals. Grow them. Oh my god, that's actually genius. Yeah. <laughs> that, genius. that is genius. Yeah. Yep. No, I'm completely behind that. Yep, grow crystals. Uh, we lost that uh, pump, by the way. Pump? The water pump. It what got struck by lightning, set, got set on fire, and then it broke. Oh, uh, low. Bad luck. Fun. Oh, it's kind of amusing where the last lightning strike was I saw. It hit the burn pit. Hmm. <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah. But no, that would be perfect, wouldn't it? You grow. Yeah. You literally grow your building material. Yeah. Completely different gameplay loop. Using existing mechanics. Beautiful! Yeah. So you have to balance growing crops and building resources. Yeah. Why also don't... makes it far harder to start turning out cash crops like we are. Yeah. Um, what? Tiroi, what I I, oh, are you out hunting, Tiroi? Do we have uh, a problem? Oh, okay, because you your can crypto you... rifle is in the storage room. Also, don't forget, guys... Yeah, I can actually not uh, have that with me with another range. No, yeah, you, you, you have to have one or the other. That's what I was saying. You're going to have to micromanage it. When you're out hunting, use your rifle, and when you're wandering around, use the crypto rifle. Hey, um, sidearm. And, uh, Izzy, uh, don't forget, you have a charge rifle and a crypto crossbow to uh, hand out to your people. Don't know where they are. They're in the storage room. Like if you look at where my mouse is. Oh no! Hang on. Oh, infested chunk crash. So. Oh, that's that's really far away. Oh, that. that's re no, that's great news for you guys. That's loads of free components. But there's three chunks, which means there's a lot there. That's four chunks. Yeah, four. Oh. Yeah. Do we have to defeat them? You don't have to do anything with it. No, this is another one where a good tactic actually is leaving it until you get your next raid, then sending uh, Tiroy out again with his long-range weapon. Shooting it um, once. Shooting it once, pelting mm -hmm. it back inside, mm -hmm. um, and then let the insects go for the raiders. Okay. Uh, Tiroy, you know you had your thing where you kept a zone around them. Do that again. Sorry? You know, you made the GTFO zone. Oh, yeah, sure. Do that around those things. Like, don't let anyone get too close, just in case. So, Graham. Yeah. I was thinking, then, we limit their building resources that they primarily use, then, to wood, crystals, 
Uh, the tribal components. And stone. And stone. That's Which what, they have that... to turn into a special kind of brick. Like, not normal bricks. Yeah, before they're happy to use it, yeah. Yeah, and it's it's a recipe where they have to combine chunks with crystals. Uh, crystals. Yep. Whose is the crypto rifle? Uh, that's Teros. When he's not All right. hunting. Alright. Using seven. If you for better items, the, the robots also put them on the shelf so you can have more time to end them out. Frame. If the game how, likely, is how likely are you to remember all this? Fairly, but I want us to sit down after, like, we finish here and just have a quick chat and write it down. Yeah, well, it's getting quite lit. The yes, bottles. it is. I'm about to. Uh, finish I was about up. to say we'll be finishing in, in about minutes. ten minutes normally. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> However, Izzy and Tiroi and gang, mm -hmm. Dan and such, like, this mod is being designed partly with you lot in mind. Yeah. Oh dear. Why, where did we That's get a flat screen been... television from? Uh, oh, I bought it for you guys. Sorry, I forgot to tell you. I bought oh. you a flat screen telly to put somewhere. Oh, okay. <laughs> put it in the room with the uh, Persona car. I'm sure you like watching TV. It's He's already, already got, got one. screen television in there. Oh, okay. And there's an ultra screen television in the hospital as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But yeah, guys, purely the reason why we've been discussing this during this game is so you guys can have input. Yep. Yes, no, I know. Oh, no, Izzy and I talked about this to make sure it was all right with her before this evening. Don't you worry, Keg. <laughs> I, I, uh, I made sure that Izzy didn't mind us nattering away about it because I do want you guys input, you know. Yeah. Um, also, I'm. can you tell me how toilet work? <laughs> Just you, uh, it's well, currently disconnected because you... the lightning strike took out the pump. Right, yeah. I wondered if it was related. That's fine. Yeah. As I was going to mention in, it, um... but you'll stop. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, would be a good idea to prioritise your constructor to build that ASAP. And then you'll get your toilet is... working again. Yeah, so to answer your question there with the toilets. Basically, if, if you ever get the icon above just your toilets, that means your sewage outlet's gone or... However, you're processing your um, um, shit. <laughs> and the reason yes. the, the sewage outlet is gone is because the pipe next to it got destroyed. I right. fire three of them, and the wind pump on top of it got destroyed. Yeah. yeah. Right. Okay, that's. Fine. Well, no, it's wind pump above it. It was so one it's not top of actually it. the wind pump that's causing the problem. It's the pipe that's causing the. No, problem. it was the wind pump. It wasn't no, there. No, we've. Which was oh, of course. It up. But I moved it one forward now, so it doesn't cause that again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. Un until it catches fire and then burns anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Fire. Because it's, ma it's made out of wood. Yeah. At least you can put it out and put it out then, unlike a lightning strike. Uh, to be honest, like it's also a wooden pipe. It takes about two seconds to replace. Yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> oh, we've got one more bedroom, ironed out, kind of. We now have the only problem with this idea, Cag. Oh, sorry, Izika. I was gonna say we now have two gardener bots, and look how quickly they just yeah are like beautiful. sewing things. Yeah. The only problem with this, Cag, is the complexity of this idea is actually approaching a vanilla faction thing, like the vanilla expanded faction packs. Yeah. I'll hit. I'll hit this problem head on. Yeah. yeah. Like in all seriousness. I'll hit this problem head on, get and see where I get to. Yeah. Like if What's nothing it? else, as much as I get this done, it's a fucking portfolio. It's it? yeah. all right. Yeah. It, this is a mini expansion pack you're developing, to be honest. Uh huh. It's great. Um. Is good. And between us, yeah, like the the the, the idea of um changing how they build things and things like that makes them feel so different. Yep. Which 
just straight away. And then the wonkery. I might and I want that to one. be quite like that that again has to be like in my head. Oh no, I know what that needs to be. I know what the wonkery needs to be. The wonkery is Where a stone circle. It? No, yeah, but it needs to look like a stone circle. Yeah, we already discussed this. No, but literally like Stonehenge. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And um, the, he sits in the middle. Tiny request. Can you make yeah. so that you can um, have a setting where you can change that name to Wonkery and Research? Yes. Wonkery and Research. Oh, Wonkery or Research. <laughs> like a mod setting because... Um, nothing against you, but uh, I'm going getting a bit of tired of the of that name. Fair enough. Can I tell you something? You know when I've already done this part? You know when they're making it one of the techno tribal components? Okay, finally. The job string literally is praying to techno gods. Nice. nice. I'm not sure what we'd actually use the um tribal components for, given that we've we've decided on crystals. Anything that we create a version of that would not use normal components, that's your tribal components. Okay. Um, Romanian man, I'm your dating. Yeah. Yep. Bet build yourself a double bed. I've. Yeah. We can't yet. I've just reassigned them to Sally's because <laughs> it's easier for now. Yeah, cool. You're in that space as well, yeah. And Lambert can have my old one. <coughs> Nurse, because that's where Sally is now. Oh, wanna... yeah. Oh, sorry. Bed. Yeah, 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 sorry. <laughs> I... Brain. <laughs> no, we're using the one there. Uh, Lambert. And then this one can be Babarabarabba, whoever this person is going to be. Fucking oh, finally, what? we get weather again. Yay. It's still raining, though. Yay. For a little while. It'll, it'll fix it. The question is, who who is the next person who's going to become Babi Aroka? Also, uh, Kag, there's one other thing we need to work out for these techno tribals. Yeah. A unique end game. Hmm. Building a ship doesn't suit them and I don't think like I don't think they should be able to be friends with the Empire like I think the Empire should be locked to hostile with them like I don't know enough about the game yet how you trigger the credits yeah Ow. we'll have to investigate that shan't we yeah also here's another question for you the quest system. Is it possible to spawn quests with set rewards? Or... I think so. As a counter question, is it possible to create a map where the quest will go to? I don't know. Because I, I, I... Like... I, I One of the other things that I've been thinking about with them to try and make them a bit more unique um, and tying into the end game thing is what if their end game um, and and like I've been well, trying to work sure. out oh nice been trying to work out like they're not gonna attack sense. the thingy are they again no it's negative. Um, what I was thinking is their end game w could be that they have to collect like a bunch of uh, unique artifacts and put them together and because um, when you read about in, in the law when you read about AI eventually they reach a state where they take over a planet yeah AI unchecked will do that my thinking is that that's what your tribe are unknowingly doing or knowingly and you have to assemble these parts together that gives the AI the processing power to start the process. And then it gets converted into an Arco world. And that's the end.
and you should get a big scary message when you put the final piece in going, if you press the on button, this is the end of the game. <laughs> yeah, well, just cracks in two. Yeah. Have they got anything we want? Do they, they buy... Got some opponents. That's about... Do they buy our stuff? Yep, we hmm? saw them all our year. Even oh. better, Graham, do we do the thing where it just makes people just swear, where it... But when you do trigger it, you just get bombarded from orbit and everybody dies, and then you see the uh, ending. No, you definitely need a warning. But other than yeah. that, yeah, that would be perfect. Fisherbot! Yeah. I'm buying that. Yeah, we... it's got, it's got Are we to the buying... point where... Yeah, actually, why not buy a Fisherbot? Their gods that... decide, decide that they are, quote-unquote, worthy. Yeah. Followed by them being incinerated. They do can't buy... Do they the uh, Grand Wild Dresser? I mean, yes. Oh no, we've gone over what we've... We have, made. I just yeah. reduced the amount of yeah, yeah we were selling and I went too oh. far. Ah, uh, okay. Um, got, in that case, we're, we're yes. Like plus wait until, you yeah, know, yeah, wait until we've bought everything we want. Then reduce. I... it doesn't matter. Yeah, just... We need to get all of their money. <laughs> Anything else? I don't think so. All right. Yeah. If you even that up now with the um. Oh, they've got some Nutramine we can buy. Oh no, we haven't done wake up production, so there's no point. Yeah. If we make the um, yayo make sense. Eight. Yeah. Uh, unless you want to buy their cows. They've got three cows. We can buy those for their milk. True. Do we want okay. Nitro Amina? No. Okay. I was just saying we haven't got wake up production, so. What? You're going the wrong way. Get all of their silver. We need all of their silver. Yeah, eight seventy eight. Sell them. They can buy eight seventy six. Well, I've got two hundred and eighteen. Uh, that's weird. My, my screen is like eight hundred. Um, for me, it's also two hundred eighteen. You, someone else do it then, because mine doesn't show right clearly. What's your show? Uh, uh mine showing just over a thousand. Okay, where's the yeah you at? Sorry, I'm there. There it is. Okay, sure. I'm doing it. It's very weird. Probably called clicking it just so the game started to save, I guess. Yeah, maybe. There you go. Nice, nice. Small too nice. Oh, I've desynced immediately. That will make yeah, sense. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> okay, make a save for do, me. Yeah, yeah do uh, it might, it might. Well, well actually, the thing is, we're yeah. gonna stop. Yeah. yeah. Let's call it. I there. was just gonna haul everything in before. Cool. Yeah, let the hauling happen. You got yourself a Fisher bot. Yes, I'm gonna install it. Do I install it next to the thing or no? Inside, no, I guess. No, install it inside the base, and then it will go out to its fisher zone. When we set one up, one would assume. Mhm. Mm I think we have the same idea. Hmm. I think uh, I and someone else had the same idea with the fishing bot. What? I'll put it next to the garden new one. <laughs> Wherever it is right now. Can you install it. Go do that. Why are you even in that bath? You have your own bath. Alright. Cool, it's installed. Wonderful. And we have got that. And then the animals. Why did somebody p p 
place. Uh, one second. I, j well, I was talking and muted, unfortunately. Just one second. I just want to oh. see it work. I've not seen a Fisher bot yet, so uh... just one second. I just <laughs> want to see it work. <laughs> it's got its little fishing rod. <laughs> it's got a little fishing rod. Oh, and look, it's its birthday today. It's yes. Yeah, it has seriously got a fishing rod. Yeah. Yep. I don't actually know if fishing bots are in the game. Uh, they're only if you've got fishing extended uh, and oh. uh, robots. Uh, and it holds it back. Thing. Yep. Well, yeah, what's it going to do? Just leave Another it. one? What the oh, gosh. What? There are now going to be a lot of insects when we trigger that. Yeah. Uh, I vote for mortar. Oh, no, the way to stay hidden. No, the way to do this is to wait until, like I said, wait until a raid happens and then yep. set them against each other and then kill the survivors. Yep. Also, I find it funny that this section, these three, must have been the three parts and that's the rest of it. <laughs> uh, what you can also do yeah, right. is uh, melee block with the... Um, it's actually four, the, uh, four parts. Yeah, yeah, very like, true. That's ridiculously powerful against Ixxon. Yes, yeah, that's a very good point. You, you basically sack him on 3,000 next to the door. Yep. Or if you're really brave at one tile. Yep. And uh, especially with this amount. Yep. And the, the vanilla insect gets one shot. Except mm -hmm. the most tanky one. Yep. They will die. Good and proper. One of our cleaning bots is only half health. Uh, then turn it off and tell it to be repaired. How do you tell it to be repaired? Deactivate there. it. Like pad repair and then robot. click the pad, and then there's a repair robot. Oh, yeah. Cost 3 plus 2. There you go. And then the crafting bot or one of our crafters will repair it. Right, take your save. Cool. Thank you very much for this evening, Izzy. This has been huge amounts of fun. Yes, Great. thank you for, uh, for yeah, doing it. It's quite a bit of fun. I, I'm enjoying this file, it's completely different. I also really like my bedroom. It's a bit crap yeah. though, I have to rearrange a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Can't imagine why. Also, the kitchen sink, uh, it should say, it should give five cleanliness, but um, it doesn't. It only affects kitchens. Ah, maybe it should have said so. Well, yeah, I, don't, I, I mean, it's know. called a kitchen sink. The clue was in the name. Oh, you stole the royal dresser to Roy. How rude. That's why I asked if I was allowed to buy it. <laughs> so I did not steal it. He definitely stole it. <laughs> oh, dear. That's fine. I've got a save, so we can now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Liverpool Hello? lost a bun. Oh. <laughs> Where's our yeah, little fisher bot gone? There he is. What's he carrying? Wait, are they the well, team that lost the uh, man new the other day? Hey, Burnley. No, no, um... Right. And I'm gonna say goodbye for today. Um, yeah, we had super fun. Got super far on this one, actually. Really, really happy with it. Um, we do this every Thursday. Um, it might not always be multiplayer because it very much depends on the stability of all of our mod packs and everything, but so far it's going well. Um, so yeah, if you want to stop by another time next week, then we should be playing the game. Um, I'm also streaming tomorrow. I'm going to be streaming, um, some ARC tomorrow. Then Saturday I've got Armour and Raft in the evening. We stream a lot, basically. <laughs> but yes, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. Hope you all had fun. Um, I know I did. It was uh, really good fun. Uh, my cat can tell that I'm uh, finishing up. She knows she's going to get fed soon. Um, and yeah, 